New, New Jersey coffee, coffee jug is streaming right now. Words. New, New Jersey, Jersey coffee, coffee jug is streaming right now. Good evening, everybody. Happy, happy, happy Saturday. NJ Coffee Junkie here. Everyone calls me NJ Coffee, your coffee junkie for short. And we're back. We're back at the Nether Mug. And you've noticed that I've been streaming a lot more than usual lately. And that's mainly because I'm home. <laughs> um, trying to make this, um, trying to make the most of this um, being sequestered thing. Oh, hello, Library of Characters. Thanks for the follow. I appreciate you. Welcome, welcome. I hope that you are, I hope that you're doing well wherever you are. Um, but yeah, so we're here and we are um, working on the nether mug. Um, we did so much last night. We had a nice, healthy, um, let's see if I can do this right. There we go. We had a nice, healthy two and a half hour stream yesterday. And so we basically went in and we started getting this space up to snuff. We put in the tables and chairs for people to, perf to see the performances. I left my shulker box in the middle of, of here, and that's going to get emptied out today. Hey, Perdlo, welcome to the stream, my dear. Welcome, welcome. I hope that you are all doing well. Hey, yo, hey, yo to you, too. Um, so, yeah, so we have the, the bookshelves, a little library for people to borrow books. We have our little return area. We should probably put a sign up there. Um, at some point, and we will. With assorted paintings on the walls, just to kind of give some character. We have um, our mascot, our little map over here. Hey, Ten, welcome to the stream. It has been a while. It's so good to see you. Uh, every time you stream, I, 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 I never seem to be able to catch it for whatever reason, and I don't know why. Um, probably because I'm either working, or I'm commuting, or I'm, I'm doing my dishes and I can't have my laptop near water because like a gremlin it's a bad combination so you're finally able to get back yes well I'm happy to hear that and hi Em welcome to the stream um so we did so much on yesterday's stream that I am just flabbergasted and I really want to um yeah laptops near water is very bad uh, I want to send a little bit of a thank you and a shout to Sixie because they came over and helped me and they, I, I had this idea for a stage and they helped me figure out how to get a microphone. Uh, so this was their idea, the armor stand with the wither skull and they really worked hard to figure out how to embed the armor stand into the stage itself so it looks like it's part of the stage. Now, one of the things that one of the things that we're gonna do on tonight's stream is we're gonna finish up this wall. I did not have enough um, item frames for the maps that I previously purchased, so those are basically um, those are basically what we're gonna go grab today. Bless you, Manatee. Manatee's in the other room. Um, so yeah, so we're gonna do that. We're just gonna take another look around and see if there's anything else we need to do. Uh, we need to put the sign up over the return a library or return a book um, area. We should probably have a sign over here for the jukebox. Sure, 55 on the stage. Yep. Mm -hmm. And then in this area here, this is the coffee bar. Um, this is the bar. So people could have coffee. They could have other stuff. Um, their choice. And so... Um, these are the fatigue mats, because um, in my previous jobs, whenever you worked behind a coffee bar or as a cashier, they provide these special mats, and you can get them in stores like Five Below or a sporting goods store or something like that, and they just provide relief if you're going to be on your feet all day. And I have them for my yoga mat because I do yoga on my hardwood floors, and before I had the fatigue mats underneath it, I would have the worst bruising on my legs because, you know, knees plus hardwood floors equals lots of pain. 
So I have that for when I do certain positions where, you know, I'm leaning forward and stuff like that. It actually really, really helps. Um, the sporadic carpet that you see around the room is to help discourage ga uh, gas spawning. And the stage itself is made of bottom level slabs. So there shouldn't be any gas spawning there. Um, we also set up this, these barrels and this cauldron. Um, you know, this is, you know, the bar back area. We have supplies that will go in these barrels, and then the wares will go in these barrels. And then since the baristas are walking around the bar, um, I have to figure out how to set up a slab or two so that I can put the brewing stands higher up. I haven't quite figured that out yet. Um, I actually haven't been on this realm since last night, as a matter of fact, or yesterday afternoon. I've been in the other one, working on a basement and stuff like that. And I promise, I promise you're going to see that very soon. But I really wanted to make sure that this was completely done, and that we all loved it, before I move on um, to that new world. And someone had actually suggested that I give a full tour of this world, and of the completed builds that are here. And as long as my server mates are totally okay with that, which I kind of think they are at this point, because I've done it three or four times, um, <laughs> and they're all on the other world now anyway, pretty much, um, I think they'd be okay with it. So that might be something we'll do in the future. Um, so for now, I need to empty all this stuff out of... I need to empty all this stuff out of my, um, out of my thing. Um, out of my inventory. So we've been using this chest kind of as a junk drawer for now. And that's exactly what we're going to do in this case. We're just going to dump all this... Wait, nope, not those. We need those. I'm just going to... Eh, we'll bring that too. I'm just going to dump all this stuff that we don't need right now in here. So that's just going to clear out the... Um, we're going to clear out this area, uh, this space completely. That's fine. Um, define completed. Um, if everyone's pretty much done for now, then anything that is most likely finished. So I'm going to show off, you know, mascot farms and I'll show off, um, I'll show off the, 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 the amusement park, that kind of stuff. Like the stuff that I showed off before. Um, but yeah, this is almost done. Is this my other one? Yeah, this is my other one. Um, and I don't know why I picked the purple one up. That was silly. Probably because I'm going to bring it over here. So I have this purple shulker, and this is my box of Joe. All of my shulker boxes are named for coffee puns because that's what I'm known for. M says that she can only think of one thing that's been completed. Um, yeah, and that happens. It totally happens. It's fine. Um, there's... This is the last thing I have to complete. Um, I don't have any other projects I can think of that are in the works. And Ten said, Sure, 55 on the stage. That's true. I have no idea who that is, but sure. Windows camera freezes up their webcams. Yeah, I, um... I decided a while ago, um, after talking with Manatee, that I would not, I would not use a, um, I would not use a webcam. Uh, mainly because um, some people already know what I look like, and that's fine. Um, but it's just, it's easier on me um, as a female, um, as a female content creator. Um, I just don't want to have to. I'd rather just keep my keep my face off, off offline. That's fine. But in any event, we are um, just basically stocking, and we're gonna actually leave the glass just in case because we always want to make sure that we can do repairs. Um, but now we have the supplies that we need. I do need to I do need to make more of these brewing stands because I want one brewing stand in each corner so. That that, you know, people can, um, so that the baristas can make their beverages and stuff. 
and we're going to just break this brewing box. That is my French press box, by the way. My French press. See, I told you. I'm full of coffee puns. It's great. Um, now. Oh, I have one painting left. I should probably put that somewhere. Where can I put it where it wouldn't be totally in the way? Maybe here. I think we'll just plunk it here. Let's see. Boop. Yeah, that tracks. That's fine. We'll do that. So that's going to be there. So we've got this wide variety. We have the um, we have the crafting bench. We're going to get that out of here. Um, we do have the brown carpet covering the chests and the jukebox. Um, that's just to prevent ghasts spawning too. Because ghasts can basically spawn on a single block, which is really annoying. Um, now let's see. We need to go make item frames. And if I'm not mistaken, item frames require, um, let's see, out of things I can't make, item frames. Alright, what do we need for that? We need leather. So if I remember correctly from last stream, we did not pack leather in the chests at all. We f looks like we forgot it. So we're just doing a quick check. Yep, that says light roast. That's my coffee mug. This is an unnamed shulker because it was a gift. I have to rename it to something. And if you guys have any comments or any thoughts about what I could name that shulker box, put them in the chat. Or if you're watching this on the YouTube replay, first off, thank you. And second, put them in the comment section below. I'm open to ideas. We've got the coffee bean that has all my food. And we have the pumpkin spice latte. That's the orange one. The light roast box that has all of my light sources in it and all of my fuel. And then we have the dirty box. Someone left that. I don't know whose it is, but it has cookies and dirt in it for some reason. And then this is the lovely transporter, which was a gift, and that's where I keep all of my equipment. Um, I should probably shove these in my ender chest. My ender chest isn't full of garbage. Almost. Let me take the garbage out. Um, so I should probably restock it with the ender chest, the shulker boxes, as soon as I'm done. And then the other problem that I have is I need to figure out what to do with all of this. <laughs> I really need to figure out what to do with all of this stuff. I have concrete and buttons for days. I have so many buttons I could open my own um, embroidery shop or something. I don't know. I just, I have a double chest full of buttons that I don't know what to do with. And that's mainly because uh, when I built the saucer that you see here, yeah, I built the saucer way too big. And I mean, way too big. So I'm just going, ow. Don't do that. It's just way too big. So when I cut it down, I ended up with all these extra buttons and I didn't know what to do. And so I have all of them. So if anybody needs buttons, I'm your girl. Uh, what we're doing right now is we are taking a field trip over to Mascot Farms because I am bereft of um, leather. And I happen to run which is Mascot Farms see it in just a second. There we go. I have to go this way. Uh, there seems to be a bit of lag on the server tonight, which makes no sense because I'm the only person on the server right now. Um, it could just be my internet connection. It could be that Realms is persnickety, which, you know, that does happen from time to time. See, there's Mascot Farms. There's Fudgy and Pinchy right there. Um, it could be it could just be that we're near my lag babies, my cows, who I haven't actually seen or interacted with in a while. You guys haven't seen it. And I'm just going to apologize right now. Um, oh, I have leather. We're going to grab that anyway. I apologize right now if it starts getting loud in here because of all the moves. Um, hello, Aquamarine2019. Welcome to the stream. Um, not this realm 
No. Um, this is the Joe Hill's Patreon realm. And I am a patron of Joe Hill's of Hermitcraft. And so, in being a patron, I am given permission to play on this world. But this is also... Ow! Put it! But this is also the Legacy realm. And so, there's a new realm for us that we play on. But we still have access to this one. So the whitelist for this is closed. Yeah. But if you're familiar with his work, well one, if you're not familiar with his work, go familiarize yourself with his work. He's great. Um, if you are, um, yeah, I, kn I know, I know, I was afraid of that. Thank you, M. Give me one second, I'll, I'll lower the, um, I'll lower the friendly creatures one. Alright, so we're not gonna hear the moose. Can't hear me over the phantoms. Okay. I'll turn down hostile creatures, too. Well, they are really loud. Mic is low, too. Okay, one second. Hold on. Is that better? Is that better? Can you hear me now? Thank you for letting me know, by the way. Can you hear me? Listen, I'm in the middle of something. Excuse you. Yeah, sorry about that. Um, I was playing Uno with my friends from Belgium and Australia yesterday. And I had my mic turned down because it was coming over really, really loudly on Steam. Listen, I am in the middle of saying things and you are interrupting me and I'm not having this today. Take my arrow in the face and like it. And you too. Done. All right, hold on. Enough with this no Excuse me. <laughs> I just got bitten the butt by a phantom. <laughs> Excuse you, buddy. <laughs> as much as I love snagging all of these phantom membranes, which I honestly I do. Uh, they come in handy for the slow falling potions that I make uh, on the server. Um, it's getting a little obnoxious. Hi, Lucky. Welcome to the stream. I'm glad you made it too. X, yes, phantoms are absolute jerks. They are terrible. As am I. Oh, oh, where'd you come from? Oh, no, 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 no. You are not walking across my roof. Excuse you. No, we're not having this today. If you haven't noticed, I have had enough of their stuff. <laughs> oh my gosh. Okay. So where was I? Yeah, phantoms are jerks. They're terrible. And the lag here is awful. I've been having issues with trying to kill phantoms with the lag all day. Now they can't come into my bedroom. I don't want them in my room. All right. That's better. <laughs> That's much better. Okay. We're good now. We're good. Um... Someone remind me to put an ender chest back here, because I kept an ender chest right there. I must have grabbed it for something, and I must not have ever replaced it. So if someone could remind me to, re to put that back, that would be great. Just, like, DM me or something. I'll remember to do it later. Alright, so now that we don't have the phantoms in the way, I can go back to my cows... And I can get what I need leather-wise. I grabbed the 32 leather I already had set aside because I was going to restock my shops with it. Because as you can see, I sell cake and I sell pie. Um, I have no idea what to sell the pie for. And apparently nobody wants chicken, which means I need to restock steak. So my poor cows are just going to get abused. Sorry, my moose. But... Yeah. Alright, do I have any hay bales? I do. It's a good rule of thumb when you are um, working with cows um, or any entity to breed them first and then, sla and then slaughter or, ca or cull them. Um, just so that you get as much as you can because, you know, you're only getting one new cow for every two. So, you know, it's... Um, you know, that, that lowers your, um, hold on, that was not smart. That was not smart on my part. Okay, come here, my babies. I'm just gonna just give you stuff until you, until I run out. 
But yeah, so how's everybody doing tonight? It's nice to see many of you for the first time in a bit, and it's also nice to see those of you who haven't been here in a while and are back after a hiatus, and it's always good to see you. Um, me personally, I've been doing gr as well as could be. Um, I have not set foot outside of my house since yesterday other than to check for the mail, which is odd. And before that, I was only out on Wednesday. Um, I found out today, as in an hour and a half ago, if that, um, that my office is um, closed in the sense of us having to go into the office. Um, we are many things, um, but um, my boss made the decision to keep us to work, uh, keep us working at home, because for what I do and for what the majority of my coworkers do, um, we have that capability, and it's a capability that we've had for quite a while, and that's basically what we're doing right now, um, and. Um, and MG is, you know, Manatee, he, he's also going to be, um, he's also going to be doing that as well, so we're going to be home. And that's good, because now I don't have to worry about him being out. Um, howdy, space! Space Dorito 49, everybody. Everyone's resident, uh, dermatologist. You want a really awesome skin? You go talk to Dorito. They are your peep. In fact, they have basically made all of my skins, except the first one I ever had. And, yeah. They're great. So, like, find them on Twitter, and hit up their DMs, and it's good stuff. They're also a really cool artist. Just saying. Well, you're really good at what you do, so I'm going to talk you up, so... Or, as they say in the wrestling business, put you over. So, eh. Boop. I'm so sorry. I feel so bad. Lucky, rest your head. If you're feeling tired, it's fine. I mean, I can't tell you how many times I've tried to watch a late night stream and have just fallen clean asleep during it, not for sake of the streamer, but because my exhaustion level was too great to overcome it. If you need to rest your head, rest your head. Be well. I'm going to probably end up streaming like every day, so don't, you know, don't feel bad about heading to bed. We've all been there. I just hope you get a really good night's sleep. <laughs> Um, but I'm glad you could be here for as short as you could. And X says, as, or 10 says that their dad would be able to work from home if Windows 10 home supported remote desktop. Ugh, that stinks. So your dad has to go into the office every day? I mean, does he work with a lot of people? My dad is retired, and he turns um, he turns 79 this year. And um, yeah, and my my brother just hit a milestone birthday too, and um, we haven't been able to see each other. And my brother's been working crazy, crazy nights or crazy days rather. And um, he he works in cons technically works in construction. I think is the best way to put it. He's been doing engineering stuff. So I have a feeling that he's going to be very, very busy over the next couple of weeks as well. Um, doesn't work with a lot of people, but we'd rather have remote access. That's definitely true. I, I feel I feel for your dad, and I feel for you for him, you know, having to go out and stuff. Um, and I hope that he, you know, continues to, you know, do what he can to stay safe out there. Um, we... Um, both of us are able to, and I'm very glad that my dad isn't working anymore, because he worked for a grocery store, um, and he thankfully retired a bunch of years ago, but I still worry about him. I haven't heard from him today, actually, come to think of it. I need to, um, I need to give him a, a ring. 
and see how he's doing. And I also need to put something here. I need to put something here to fill that sand in because that little spot right there is going to drive me nuts. This also has to be converted over to grass, but one thing at a time. One thing at a time. Actually, this grass over here could be put here, and that sandstone could be put... No, I wanted them to sit on the grass. That doesn't make sense. I need one thing of sandstone, but I don't want to leave a hole here, because then the chickens will get out. Because the chickens, they are they are very sneaky, 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 sneaky poultry. They love going out on adventures. So do the cows. There was one time where all the cows got out, and I must have spent 20 minutes corralling them back in. And I feel bad because I've heard people say, you know, it's not good to keep the cows in a pen. But if I didn't keep the cows in a pen, um, they would be all, at least in this realm, I think that they would um, end up lagging the server. So I don't mind if one area is laggy as opposed to the entire server. And it won't be laggy for long. I mean, I have to take... I have to take all the adults out and leave the babies, much as I don't want to. Especially if I'm experiencing lag now, the fewer entities that are here, the better. But I do have almost a full stack of leather, so sorry, cow. I am so sorry. Oh, breaks my heart every time. Okay, so we have a little more than a stack of leather. I think that's good enough for now. I'm going to leave the rest of the cows alone. But I will do this. That's a very satisfying sound, by the way. <laughs> um, okay, so we have our leather for our item frames. I do have some sticks, so I can start making item frames here. So let's do that. Item frames. We'll make as many as... Oh, because I only have enough sticks to make one. But I have planks, so let's make some sticks. We'll make a bunch of sticks, and then we'll make a bunch of item frames. We've got 21 item frames. And we still have plenty of leather left over, so that's fine. That's totally fine. So we're going to head back over. We're going to head back over to the nether mug, unless there's something I'm missing. Okay, space. Catch you in a bit. Is there anything else I'm missing, my peeps, while I'm over here? Because I got the, I have the item frames, and I put all of the brewing supplies. Um, I put all of my brewing supplies in the shop. Like everything I didn't have that I don't have in the, um, in the main coffee shop. I put there. Like, I have tons of wood and everything else, and I just overshot the inn. Go me. I'm great. <laughs> I think one of the things that I want to work on, you know, before tonight to finish this up is figuring out how to do the, um, how to do the signage in terms of what's available, right? Um, it, oh, I must have used my last rocket. Oops. All right. Looks like we're taking the long way up. That's fine. We'll just take the long way up. Yeah, there have been a couple of times when I was building this, as I said before, with the ghasts and everything, where I didn't... I was just kind of just chilling, hanging out and everything, and... There have been a couple of times where I came back, like if I stepped away to use the restroom or whatever, and there's nothing up here. I've come back and I've been dead. I've been dead. Because a ghast came and like wrecked my life and destroyed my face. And it's like, what? Oh, hi, Lily Builds. Thanks for the follow. Welcome to the stream. Okay, now I know I have an extra ender chest in here. Not here. In one of these, I think. And that has to go inside. 
I know I have an extra ender chest. Em, are you saying because Mildred's is sold out, or because I need to go to Mildred's for something? How's it going, Lily Builds? Okay, so we're gonna use we're we're gonna need those signs. So we're gonna take those with us. Oh, thanks, Em. Okay. I'm seriously, <laughs> I'm seriously looking for that ender chest. <laughs> I thought I brought one up here. <laughs> oh, heck. Yeah, that link, by the way, that link should definitely work. If it doesn't work, I'm going to be very, I'm going to be very disappointed. Thank you, Em. All right, so... There are no ender chests here, but I do have this one. This one is probably going to end up moving inside when I'm ready, because there should be an ender chest. So, hold on, before I make a mistake, we take the silk touch pick, we break the ender chest with the silk touch pick, boop, okay, so there's that. Let's go back inside. Oh. Hold on. I'm good. Thanks. But thank you for reminding me to put some in my hands. But yeah, I will buy more rockets soon. Don't worry. Okay, so. The ender chest, which technically would be where people pay, would probably be... It wouldn't be here, because that's where people come in. So, and I put stuff in this one, and I put... St oh, I didn't put anything in this one. Very good. Okay. So we're going to break this barrel, right? Hear me out. We, we, we broke that barrel. We're going to put the plank here. Then we're going to take the ender chest, right? Because it's, it's not a real store if you don't have an ender chest in it. Boom. Done. There we go. I probably do need more ender chests. I just have to figure out, um, I just have to figure out if I really, really do or not. Because I swear I thought I had an extra. And we'll put that there, right? Actually, wait, no. Not that. We don't want the spruce plank. We want the barrel. Because we want to keep the supplies underneath. And did we... Uh, close enough, that's fine. They don't have to be uniform. But we do have the fatigue mats here and here, which is good. So you basically come in, and then this... I'm, I almost want to get a trap door. Wait, do I have a trap door? I might have a trap door. Hold that thought. Because you know, just like I have on um, at Joe Thrills for the food court, I have... You know, like some bars, they have that piece that's attached to the bar, but then they can flip it up and then walk through and then flip flip it closed. We have that in the Fallycraft Cafe. I think I can do that here as well. That's a pressure plate. A pressure plate's not going to help me any. Um, excuse me. Um, huh. I have a spruce plank. Alright, no. We're gonna... We're gonna get, um... No. I can Minecraft, I swear. Okay, so this is all ores and stuff, so we're not going to worry about that. What do I have in this one? I have... Let's see. Hold on, you know what? I'm going to take one of these. One of these spruce logs. And convert it. Because I have a ton of spruce. You think those are called gates? They probably are called gates, but I'm actually, I'm legitimately not sure. So I just call them trap door, or I, like I use the trap doors, but um, okay, so I don't have enough for, let's see. 
I need an oak trap door. I need six. Oh, okay. I have five. So I need one more. I just did that. That's great. Okay. Try this again. Again, I swear I can Minecraft. It's fine. You're just watching because, you know, hilarity ensues. At least I entertain. Alright, so, let's try this again. Spruce trap door. Let's do that. So we've got the trap door. Let's see if we can get it to work. On the carpet. Um... Let's see. We're gonna try. Anything is worth trying once. Boop. It worked! It looks weird, but it worked! <laughs> it worked! <laughs> Yay! That's so good! Oh, that's such a relief. Oh, that's cool. Oh no, Lucky, you can't sleep? That's terrible. Well, I hope that I, um... I hope that you are, um... able to fall asleep soon. Because I understand how bad insomnia can be. I really do. Um, so let's keep our fingers crossed for Lucky that they get some sleep tonight. Now, here's the thing with this, right? Here's the thing. I'm looking at this and I'm I love the trap door cuz it's exactly how it should be. But it's the carpet that's throwing me off. It's it's all of this, right? Cuz this 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 is good. Now I could do a couple of things. I could re uh, reimagine this or like go back to the drawing board cuz I think I have some dark oak. And I could try dark oak. Right? I could try dark oak and see if that blends in better. Which actually might. Let me let me do that. Let me see if I have any dark oak left. If not, I'm gonna have to think of something. And space, if I don't have any dark oak and you happen to have some, because I think I gave all the dark oak I had left over back to uh I gave it all back to Sixy last night. Because they loaned me a stack and a half. So if I don't have any... I have three dark oak planks. I need three more. Do I have any, though? That would be a big old negative Nelly. Dang it. I was really hoping I had some. Yeah, go ahead. Yeah, please. That would be great. I'm sorry to bother you. I know you're probably working on stuff. But yeah, if you could bring me, um, what is it, like one, one, one dark oak log? Because I'm, ch I'm checking every box I have. And yeah, I didn't think that far ahead. Okay. Well, if you're not like super, like super, super busy... I just want to see how this would look with a um, with a dark oak, dark oak um, trapdoor. Now, next thing, have to figure out what to do um, for these these brewing stands. Because again, as long as there's enough space to walk around, the baristas can do their job. So what I'm thinking is. In this spot here, which I'm actually going to mark with a piece of brown carpet. So here, here, and here, and here, we'll have the four brewing stands. And this I'm actually going to break and pray that it... Okay, good. So in those four corners, right, we're going to put the brewing stands. But I have to figure out what I want to put them on. So... What are some suggestions that you all might have for that? Because I'd really like to kind of think about something that fits the aesthetic, um, something that will will stand it up, and that's fine. That's wow, that's really loud. They are nearby. Um, 
something that fits the aesthetic, something that would kind of get it above or close to the countertop. Because you know when you visit a coffee shop or whatever, you see the urns and you see the stuff, or if you're over 21, you go to a bar, you see the bottles on the countertop and stuff. That's kind of the thought process I have for this. That's kind of where I'm think. That's kind of what I'm thinking for this, is you know what can I put there to boost up the brewing stands to get them to where they need to 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 get them to that that height level, and also not have it look really funky. You know what I mean? Like have it look really neat. And then obviously I would have to make make some of the brews, which is what I have. Um, all this stuff in here for um, I think I've got the bottles in this one yeah I have the bottles in this one and actually I should probably move some of these bottles over to this side item frames with potions um, I could put those on the barrels and that would be fine and I was actually thinking about that and that's why I grabbed as much leather as I did because I wanted to um, I wanted to be able to um, finish off the the background, but also maybe do that for that. And I do have some potions outside that I'm going to use for that. So, where did I put those maps? Because I'm going back and forth between all the different projects as they pop into my head. So, please don't mind me. Um, I'm very much a it's in front of me, I'm just going to tackle it now kind of person. So, the item frames are here. And so I appreciate you following along with me in my thought process. And I hope that you find it as amusing as I do. Let's see. I think we should cover the whole thing. Do I, and I can't put scaffolding down because these are half slabs. So, we're just going to have to play it by ear. And then, let's see if I can do this. <laughs> Got it. All right. Okay. So that's better. I think we might be able to go all the way up. Bless you. All right. Hold on. Now, would it look funky if it went all the way up? Kind of, it's kind of like a green screen. And yes, this is what the pattern looks like. It's Victorian wallpaper. And I really dig it. And where did I put that scaffolding? Okay, scaffolding's over here, I think, right? No, but those the sticks will come in handy. Oh, space! Never mind, I found my... I knew I had dark oak planks. I have them. I have them. I must have left the I must have left the scaffolding outside. Not a big deal. Hmm. You needed one anyway, so you're just going to keep what you gathered. Okay. We're going to have to do this the old school way. We'll use the wool. Oh, nope. I still oh, cause there's a <laughs> there's a lantern in front of me. Okay, got it. And then the map. Okay, so now this is where it starts getting a little bit squirrely. Everybody, bear with me, cause I don't have the scaffolding with me. But nope. Dang it. Alright, so we'll do that instead. We'll just chop it down and put it back up. Alright. So what have you all been up to this weekend? Um, for me, it was a very quiet day. I wouldn't say a lazy day per se, but it was a very quiet day. Um, 
as we were trying to, my coworkers and I were trying to figure out what our future held with uh, being home and everything. Um, we were watching most of the Hermitcraft stream day. Uh, I had woken up early. Although, to be honest, I was waking up already, so it wasn't that early. Um, to be able to catch uh, Joe's, Joe Hills's stream at 8 o'clock. And then I took a nap during Doc's, which is hard to do, because he plays really great music, like Metallica and, um, excuse me, Iron Maiden and stuff, and I was really into it, but my body just basically just stopped. Like, it just went, you know what, you cannot stay awake right now, you haven't had coffee, you're too tired to make coffee, just curl up on the couch, because I was watching on my laptop in the living room. Like, I'm playing on my laptop in the living room right now. Like, you know, um, my body said, curl up on the couch, take a 45-minute nap, it's good stuff, you're going to be fine. And I did. And I felt great when I woke up. And, you know, Manatee was, Manatee had woken up a around then by that point, so, you know, the two of us, we just kind of, you know, hung out and chilled a little bit. And that was, that was great. It was just us, you know, watching, watching the Hermitcraft. Um... We were listening to um, Cub and Scar. Um, I made dinner. It was, it was just a, it was just a nice, quiet time. We made dinner together, which is always good, always, always good. Um, on the days where, you know, I was home this past week and and he was working in the office, you know, I would, um, if I was, I would stream, which is why my streams were so early. So that by the time I was done, or close to being done, you know, he would be home, and then we could make dinner and just, you know, sit and chill and relax for the rest of the night, you know? So, like, that was, that was, like, part of the goal, um, to just be able to do that. And now we're both home, so we'll be able to, um, we'll be able to, you know, continue to make dinner together, and it'll be, it'll be nice. We're making the most of it. Um, tomorrow... We're going to continue, um, we're going to continue getting the house completely, um, deep cleaned and organized, and we're going to listen to, um, we're going to listen to the, you know, Hermitcraft stream day. Um, I'll probably be awake at 8 o'clock in the morning again for, um, for Zed's, uh, for Zed's, uh, stream. Um, I love watching his streams, he's always, he's a trip, and his Discord, um, is really just a fun place to be. They're good people. Most of the Hermit's Discords are, are full of good people. Yeah, see, okay, this to me looks better because it matches the, the dark aesthetic. I think the, um, I think this was, the, the spruce one was too light. I think this works. It looks, it looks very heavy and clunky, but it, but it works. I think we're going to stick with that. M says that I should use item frames with potions, which I'm going to figure out how to do, I think. Yes! That's good stuff. I don't think I'm going to be able to... Oh my gosh! Dig that! I could put an item frame on every side of the barrel. I didn't think I could do that. That's great! And I have just enough. Oh my gosh, look. I have just enough. Ah! That's so good. That's so good. <laughs> oh, that's perfect. Yay! Oh, that's awesome. Okay. Okay. So, now we can... Now we're in business. Now we can... Now we can do things! <laughs> As you're all looking at me like... This, this chick is nuts, but I'm not nuts. I'm just enthusiastic. Okay, so I need suggestions. Give me suggestions on what I can do for this space. Now, obviously, I will put the potions in item frames. That's that's perfectly fine. There are like eight different potions. That's That works. That, that's fine. But um, I'm adorable, not nuts. I can be both. I don't mind being a pistachio. That's fine. I, I like pistachios. 
and walnuts. Um, but, uh, what was I going to say? Yeah, so I can definitely put the potions in, in, the, uh, in the item frames. Like, just, I have the anvil outside, rename one for however many diamonds it would be, plunk it in there, done and dusted, fine. But it's these, this area here. I need some sort of platform for the brewing stands. I'm not sure what to make to put the, to, I'm not sure about the platform. Now, I could do something simple like scaffolding, because I know I can put stuff on scaffolding, because if I put a brewing stand on scaffolding, a ghast can't spawn. I would hope. But I'm not, I'm not sure. So if you have any thoughts, plunk them in the chat, or you know, if you're watching this, and if I haven't figured it out by the time this is over, if you're watching this on the replay, then throw a comment, um, throw a comment in the, com you know, like, throw something in the comment section. Let me see what you think. Um, but we're going to step out of here for a second, because I have to go, wait, hold on. Let me make sure first. Okay, so we have that bottle, that barrel has the water in it, and this, well, wait a minute. Oh, jeez. Dorito. I heard the pressure plate go off and I thought it was a pigman. <laughs> I thought it was a pigman. Because they come in here from time to time. Because, you know, they're thirsty. Alright, so this has all of my brewing equipment. So it has the blaze rods, it has the bottles and everything else. The bottles I should probably take with me because they're empty. And they're being them being empty here is meaningless. So I have basically everything I need to make all the different potions, including water breathing. <laughs> Clean cat is a happy cat. You were just taking a bath? All about a Saturday night, as the song goes? Alright, so. I do not have my potions in here so I have to go get them and they are in my they're in one of my chests over here well he sends kisses Aw, tell Welly I said hi and kisses back to the pupper well he's a good pup all right we're gonna just deposit this stuff in here you like the giant Dorito painting <laughs> as do I I love that one Sixty told me that the blue skull is their favorite, and my favorite is this one. It's very metal. All right, so let's see what what do I have in my ender chest? Uh, not I keep saying ender chests. What is wrong with me? Jeez, you're petting him for me. Aw, thank you. All right, so what potions did I remember to bring with me? I have strength and health, so that's a start. Strength and health. Nada. Diddly squat. Diddly squat. Oh, I should probably put a furnace in there too, but I, because I thought about building a fireplace. Hmm. Fireplace. Hmm. fireplace hold that thought fireplace hold that thought all right so I here's where I stored all the potions so we're gonna put all these buttons and all this other all this other all these other odds and ends we're gonna just shove them in this in here and we'll shove the empty bottles too instant health we're just gonna just toss all this stuff um we don't need the stone stairs okay i don't know why my mr t is in there but that's fine okay so now we have all this stuff the leather is if we needed more item frames we're gonna put that there for now we've got the signage let me grab another let me grab another piece of white dye because we're gonna paint the signs Oh, hold on. The 
the anvil's out here. So that's going to come with me inside. And just in case, we'll bring the crafting bench too. Okay, there we go. In we go. So we're going to put down the anvil. And we're going to put down the crafting bench. Now we have eight different, um, we have eight different slots for potions. So I want some help in listing what the different potions are. And if someone could jot this all down in chat, that would be great. We have strength. We have speed. We have instant health. We have... Um, so that's three. Speed, strength, instant health. We have slow falling. We have water breathing. We have poison, weakness. That's, that's, that's seven right there. Regeneration is eight. Turtle Master is nine. All right. Poor M is trying to type this down as fast as possible. Regen Turtle Boy. The one I won't sell is Turtle Master because I won't kill turtles. I also don't really see turtles, so it's hard to kill them if I don't see them. And I also don't have regen. No, I refuse to kill turtles. You will kill them. You shouldn't need to. Well, I don't... I don't know. I always thought you had to kill turtles to get the, to get the, to get the shells. Ow. Hold on. I'm like shifting my legs. You have a turtle farm. Okay. Well, I don't know this. Um, I would assume so. I mean, I haven't, I haven't tried to make them. I just, I won't, I just won't kill turtles. So if other people want to sell me if other people want to, you know, help me with turtle shells and I don't have to kill turtles, I'm all for it. I think the turtles are too cute. It's like, I mean, I have to, I have to call the cows and it, it kills me inside, but it has to be done. Just, the turtles are so cute. Uh, okay, so hold on. I'm getting ahead of myself. Oh, you just need the turtles to grow up and they drop their, they drop their shells. Oh, I didn't know that. Oh, okay, good. I don't have to kill cows. That's great. That's even better. Um, okay, so... Um, we have strength. We have instant health. Um, hold on. I'm going to drop the extras off, and I'm going to put them in this chest. So we have strength. We have instant health already here. We have fire resist. That's an instant health. That's an instant health. We have poison. We have regular strength, so that kind of counts. Um, slow falling. Wait, I think that... Yeah, slow falling. We threw a couple of those in there. Uh, night vision. Forgot about that. That's another strength. So, one, two, three, four, five. We have five right now. So, what I might need to do is go back, because I know that I have all these other potions. I could swear I grabbed one of each. Strength, instant health, fire, resistance, slow falling, poison. I'm missing weakness. I'm missing weakness, I'm missing regen. Okay, not a big deal, not a big deal. So what we'll do is we will start renaming. So we have potion of strength. Um, hmm. 
Now, see, hold on. Before I even... No, you know what? No, I'm not going to rename them. Because that's... that's. I have 87 levels to do it, but I don't know how to do it where it'll look... It'll look good. Okay, so this is strength. So we'll put that there. And then we'll put healing here. And then this is fire resistance here. Yeah, I'll sell the splash versions. That's fine. And then... Poison and slow falling. Poison is automatically... Um, a splash potion, in my opinion. We'll put the poison in here. Wait, I because I already put I put strength and poison in the same thing. That's funny. Okay. So we have a <laughs> Doritos already ready. <laughs> Doritos ready to go. Oh bless. Bless, bless, bless. Okay. So we're getting there. We're almost we're almost there. We're almost there. Now this require this is gonna require me to do one of two things. Either set up the brewing stands and just start brewing, which is something I could do, or run to my shop and go there. Um which I'm not going to do. I think we we should do two things. One, figure out what pedestals the brewing stands should have. Oh my goodness. You didn't. You broke out a suit. You look so dapper. I love it. I love it. Tail and all. <laughs> I could watch this all night. That's great. That's fine. I like it. Fancy Dorito. Alright, I don't know why this garbage is in my under chest, it's fine. Okay, so here's what we're going to do. Before I forget, because I will forget, because I'm all over the place. We have two things we need to do, right? So first things first, we're going to come over here, and we're going to put, we're going to put a sign right here, boom, that says, return your borrowed actually no return your borrowed books here done now because spruce is not exactly the lightest of woods we're gonna just boop return your borrowed books here and that that being where it is is fine because if I wanted to put another row of bookshelves, which I could totally do because I have two bookshelves left over, I could do that and just have the chest down here and that would be good. So boom, return your borrowed books here. And then this side is perfectly fine. I do, I can put a sign right here. Actually, wait, I cannot. I can't put a sign here because the carpet basically counts as a bottom slab. Space says they are very dizzy now. Well, you kind of did that to yourself. Yeah, because if I take these pillars down, it's not going to look right. These pillars are fine. So what I could do is... See, I don't want to mar the front. I want that to just be... I want that to just be the way it is. And we already have signage out here that says NJ's Nether Shop. I could put a sign... Like, I can't put it here either because it's a slab. I mean, I could put it there like that. But I think that would mar the um it would mar the saucer so i'm not i'm not feeling that and the ah, <laughs> i knew i had an ender chest in here somewhere <laughs> nice okay so yeah that happened i knew i had one so all this i have to take with me i'm just going to clear this out now cuz i want to um 
I want to get rid of all these signs. And I did, um, I did take screenshots of what was written, so I have a, um, I have a memento. Alright, so we can finally take those with us. And we're gonna take this down. No, I took, I took screenshots of that whole poem and everything, don't worry. I did, I promise. You're just ready to go, and I love it. I just, I love it. <laughs> Alright. I need to figure out if I should just use... Oh! oh! Wait, I have an idea. I have an idea. And I need... I need... Dorito says, I am the local busy person. I require coffee to suffer through the pits of darkness that is my office environment. That is kind of hilarious, not gonna lie. Alright, I have andesite, I have cobble... Oh, come on, don't tell me I don't have cobblestone up here. You've got to be kidding me. There is no way I came all the way up here and didn't grab cobble. Okay, wait, we have stone. We have stone. We have stone, and we have a fortune pickaxe. This is how we're going to figure it out. Okay. Alrighty. There we go. I'm just gonna... I'm just gonna make a whole bunch of cobble at the moment. And by the way, um, I do have all these stacks of stone that I no longer need. So if you want them back, take them. Alright, so I have 18 cobble. That's more than enough. I'm gonna put all this in the double chest. And this double chest is full, I think. Yeah, this double chest is full. I'm going to have so much fun, quote unquote, fun, figuring out how to transport all this stuff when I'm done. It's going to be obnoxious. In a, in, a, in a good way. So, sticking with the aesthetic, even though it's dark in here, and it's going to look a little bit silly, but I don't care because it matches the outside. What? And I realize that I can't have the item frames here. <laughs> I can't have the item frames here because I'm putting this. Well, actually, I should be able to have the item frames. Am I off by one? That's really weird. Oh, I see. So two of them on this end. So this needs to come one more out or I leave this I leave this item frame blank. And that's fine. So we'd only have a few and oh, that doesn't look even. <laughs> it doesn't look even. <laughs> it doesn't look even. No. Oh, poop. Okay, hold on. Hold on. Uh, I, I literally just plunked it down. Alright, hold on, peeps. Hold on. NJ made a boo-boo. NJ's gotta fix it. One second. So... If you, if you insist on licking it, go ahead. I'm not gonna stop you, but I'm just gonna tell you. Whatever side effects you experience from the Vex magic, I take no responsibility in it. Because you're just going to do you. But see, yeah, this doesn't look right now. This does. This looks uneven. I didn't even realize that. So, no worries. This is what we're going to do. We're going to take out our Silk Touch pick. Right? And we are going to... We're going to cut across here. Hold on. There we go. Silk touch pick. We're going to widen this 
by one. And that's fine. That's perfectly fine. It's okay. No harm, no foul. This is why we experiment. And we're going to break... No! Dang it. And now I can't pick that up. Hold on. Spruce plank. Plunk. Grab that. Grab that. So then this will come out like that. And I know that I have some white carpet in here. So I'll grab two of those. Done and done. And then one, two. Now I could change this carpet. I could replace it and grab the light blue carpet. And that would work just fine. Now we're going to take the panes that we just snagged. That was not what I intended. We're going to try that again. <laughs> Boop. Right? And then one here. And then have it loop around. I might have to go make more panes, and that's not a problem. Yeah, I have to go make more panes. I think I left the glass... I left the glass somewhere. But at least I have the black carpet. So let me do that first. How much for the Vex magic? The Vex magic is the... Mm. Well, I have more outside. I need that where it is. If you want Vex magic... I'll sell you half a stack. You can't. I bought the last stack. Did I buy the uncooked stuff? I don't know what you mean by that. Non-glazed. No, I bought that. I don't have unglazed terracotta. And I don't have light blue. I don't have... I, I, oh, I have two light blue. I'm going to actually take that inside so I can see it. Because there should be some blue. I mean, it is a darker room. But there should be some part of the um, outside inside. If that makes any sense. Now, I have the crafting bench on me. So, we'll plunk the crafting bench down. And we'll make one set of glass panes, which we're going to get more, way more than we need. But that's fine. I'd rather have more than less. And it, yeah, see if I do that. So that's the right amount. Now I need black carpet. Which I have over here. Put the panes in there. Okay, good. Um, okay. Give me one second, everybody. I just have to pause for a split second and rest my fingertips. Alright. Oh, ow. And also stretch my legs. Ugh. We've been going now for a little over an hour. So I'm going to politely request that if anybody needs a health and safety break... Just to stretch legs, grab a sip of water, which is what I'm about to do right now, any of that other stuff. Please feel so inclined. I'm not going to stop you. In fact, I heartily encourage it. So, if, and that's me opening a bottle of seltzer. Um, so, have at it. I'm just going to have a couple, couple of sips.
Okay. <sighs> Alright. I am feeling a little bit better. I don't know about you guys. I hope you are. Alright. Good. Good, 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 good. Okay. Sorry about that. I just, I really needed to, I really needed to do that. Okay, good. All right, so thanks for bearing with me, taking those few minutes to stretch my legs and reposition myself and everything. Um, I'm still streaming from my living room, so um, I sit on my couch while I stream, and I'll sit with my legs crossed or flip to the side or something like that, and so when I feel my knees and my like my lower thigh tighten, I have that tells me that I need to move around a little bit and stretch them out so that they don't, if they stay like that, then I start getting Charlie horses and those things hurt. They hurt like hell. And I would rather not experience that during a stream. Thank you very much. Um, cause I don't think you need to hear me yelling and cursing in pain. Um, okay. So crisis averted. Uh, we were able to expand this out by one so that all of this looks nice and uniform. We can go ahead and we can put the item frames that we took, that I know, that I took down earlier, um, back into place so that it matches. We're going to have to get bottles of the, the different, um, we're going to have to get bottles of the different things to ensure that um, it has stuff there. And then um, as much as I don't want to rename them, I might have to. Okay. Um, so I have to figure out, I have to figure out what to do with that. <laughs> oh, you put trap doors on the barrels to, um, to keep the ghasts out. Is that what just happened? I should probably make two more of those because those spruce doors look good. Wait, wait, that's that's spruce, right? No, that's fine. If that means that if that means that ghasts can't spawn on them, then I'm all for it. Okay, yeah. So I'll make two more spruce trap doors. That's fine. Cause that totally looks okay. That looks totally okay. Alright, let's see. Spruce. I need more spruce. Wait. Did I not have spruce trapdoors? I thought I... Did you take the spruce trapdoors from the chest over here, Space? Because there's the other dark oak one that I made. No, okay. So they're here somewhere. still in my inventory. Well, these have to get put back. That's for sure. Um, hmm. Hmm. You love the wallpaper? That's, that's six he's doing. That's not my doing. Six he did that. We're just gonna use up these, um, we're gonna use these, um, book bookcases. Why not? That looks good. Actually, you know what? I have an idea. Hold on. We'll break this, right? And then we'll put a bookcase... We'll, we'll, we'll pick up the book in a second. Once I put this down, and then once I put the chest... Oh, I can't put... Oh, for Pete's sake. Hold on. We'll, catch, we'll pick up that bookshelf in just a second. Put the chest down. Then we'll put the book in the chest. And then that's going to allow us to pick up the bookshelf. And then we'll climb, climb up here. We'll take that brown carpet. Oh. I can't because that sign is there. Hold on. 
I'm gonna have to replace it. Yeah, see, there we go. So what I can do instead is put this, take the sign, right? Because I still have a piece of white dye, that's fine. And put the sign here that says, re return, you, uh, borrowed books here, and then the arrow over here. And then grab the white die, right? Follow me here. And then, boom. Okay, so how does that look? Does that look okay? I think that looks great. I'm really excited about that. That looks fine to me. That looks outstanding. I like it. I really like it. You think it's cute? Okay. So we're 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 doing we're doing all right. We're doing we're doing well. All right. So next item of business. Next item of business. Let me just make sure that I am. Okay, that is muted. Perfect. Okay. So next item of business is that we... Um, I thought about putting a sign here, which I could totally do. But any sign is going to get in... would get in the way normally of... This, the map that's here. That map is not moving. So we're going to put a sign here instead that says um, jukebox um, free to play all your faves in the chest. Now I'll go and get white dye and I'll go get white dye and fix that. I have some over here. We'll grab one thing of white dye. Now I have to um I know that there is a record farm um on the server that Sixy runs. And I will just I will have to go and visit it so I can get um so I can get records, because I only brought two over. I only have um, C418, um, 13, and I have Cat. And there are, I think, eight or nine others. So I want to make sure I go get those. I'm also going to need to, um, I'm going to need to fill all these different things. And I have to make two spruce trap doors, or at least find where I put the trap doors. I probably chucked them in a, a chest outside. And then I have to take the brewing stands, one of which is here. So I'm going to put that here. Oh, yeah, look at that. Look at that. That looks so good. That looks so good. Oh, my gosh. Look at this. This is great. This is perfect. Yes, 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 yes. So I need to make four more brewing stands, and I need to put them on these pedestals. Now... I have, um, ah, poop, where'd I put them? That's not it. It's probably over here. Uh, three more, three more, three more. I can math, I swear. So I need three blaze rods. I have the cobble. And I have the, um, ah, shoot, where'd I put the crafting bench? Okay, there we go. So I can make three more brewing stands. And so we go one here, one here, and then one there. So perfect, right? That looks great. Now that they're now that they're going, I come in here, I grab three water bottles, I put the water bottles in here, and I don't have to do anything with them really. I can just leave them I can just leave them like that. It would help if I grabbed the water bottles every time, though. That would be ideal. And I'm just going to shove this stuff in there so I can grab the six bottles at the same time and not have to go back and forth.
All right, so now we have our aesthetics set up almost. We just need to fill the item frames and make trapdoors. So, or find where I put the trapdoors. Let's see, we got slabs, we got brown wool, we got the one trapdoor that doesn't match, brown carpet. Because I could put, I could put carpet across them too, but I'd rather not. Excuse me. <sighs> Alright, so they're not in there. Which means I probably dumped them in here? I did. I dumped them right there. Okay, good. So I found the trapdoors. I'm gonna go back in and put them here. So I think it's back up. One, two... I need, um, everything that isn't cat or 13. I have cat and 13 here. Okay. And now I need to fill the stock. So, that's empty. That's not going to fill anything. So this, this one is, um, healing. Okay. So this is healing potion. And that's strength. So that, let's see, strength goes in here. Night vision, potion, instant health, strength. Okay, this is healing. So instant health, instant health, instant health. That all, that all goes in there. Okay. Now, I, I originally put poison on this side. That's not going to fly. Um... <laughs> That's slow falling. So we'll put slow falling in that one. Um, I'm going to put night vision here for now. And then... No, I'm not going to put my shield. Jeez Louise, I'm a mess. Alright, no, that's not how this works. That goes there. Um, we need po uh, poison. You have acquired records. Fantastic, thank you. Um, so we have most, if not all, of the, the item frames filled, which is great. Um, let me let me do something new for the very first time. I'm, it's this one, okay. I'm gonna grab some nether wart, and I am going to make regen potion for the very first time. Oh, it would be helpful if I had the blaze rods, right? <laughs> Oops, where's the blaze powder? That was dumb on my part. Blaze powder. Okay. Okay, so I'm going to fill these with blaze powder now. Because that's a key component. <laughs> that's a key component in this equation. Is, is it having blaze powder? And yes, obviously I will take the blaze rods and I will grind them into more blaze powder and, and stuff like that. That's fine. Okay, so this one has the awkward potion in it. Now, if I remember right... That should make regen potion. And I'm sitting here, I'm, I'm sitting here just waiting because I'm like, is this going to work? Did I do this right? Did I, did I make it right? Did I do it right? Three, two, one. Yeah! Aw oh, yeah! I made regen potion. Aw oh, yeah! Sweetness. And I don't know what just happened, but I'm hearing a lot of weird noises. Oh, you put the record player on. I was like, what the heck? What is that? What is that? For real, seriously. Is that 13? I have no idea. I think it's cursed. 
the best jam. Okay, as long as it's not one of the tinny sounds, because then I would start crying. Is it the cracked one? Oh, okay, so I took these out. So I need to put new... Um, I need to put new water bottles in. Or else it'll look empty. Boop, boop, boop. Okay. So now these are all ready to go. And this one that I had the night vision for, I can take one of the regen potions, plunk that there instead, put the regen potions in here. Um, now obviously I need to think about, um, I need to think about what, um, what prices I'm going to charge. Now, for those who are on the legacy server, the prices for everything that already existed are the same. So it's going to be one diamond for strength, instant health, and speed one. And it's going to be two diamonds for everything that's level two. Um, I think. Hold on. I actually have a... Yeah, this is this tracks too. This this is a good jam too. Um, it could be the cracked disc. Um, so I have a folder and for my for my Minecraft screenshots and those screenshots, um, I take screenshots of everything. And months ago, when I first started my second coffee shop. I took screenshots of what my coffees were called and what the prices were. Now, I could go ahead and charge different prices. And please let me know if you can't hear me over the music that's playing, because I hear it's really loud in my ear. And that's fine. It's actually a good jam. But I'm looking for this now, so don't mind me. I'm, I'm looking for these prices. Meanwhile, I have tons of pictures of, of, of me building the Persephone build from a couple of months ago. Where's that? Oh, for crying out loud. Hold on, I need to enlarge this. I will be right with you, everybody. I'm looking for this one picture scattered and all this other stuff so I can figure out my prices. Ah, found it. Okay, excellent. Very good, very good, very good. Space says that disc 11 is fitting for this environment. It's the best jam, but... But, but gosh, stall is fitting for this environment. Got it. Agreed. Absolutely agreed. See, this, this has the right vibe for this coffee shop. Well, it has the right vibe for any of my coffee shops, let's be fair. Um, it's a, it might be, a, it might seem a little peppy for this space, but I think if you look at the outside and how just kind of bleak and desolate it is from being on the nether roof, in here it's that nice warm inviting space. I think that really works. Um, but yeah, so I found the picture of all the different coffee prices. And for those of you on the legacy server who are watching right now, this is basically what it's going to boil down to. So for... Any level one of of speed, instant health, and strength, it's one diamond a bottle. For anything that's eight minutes long, that is also one diamond per bottle. Anything that's level two is two diamonds per bottle. Invisibility, night potion, and slow falling are all two diamonds a bottle. Regen. I'm going to sell it at three diamonds a bottle because it is really hard for me to get gas tiers. It took me months to get my first gas tier and that was because someone gave it to me as a gift. So I'm going to say that's three diamonds per, three diamonds per bottle for regen. Um, weakness is a diamond, poison is a diamond. Um, if when I make water breathing, because I will make water breathing, even though everybody has aqua affinity, I've never made water breathing potion before, I'll make that one diamond. Because pufferfish aren't that hard to come by. Well, now they are. 
but I'll still make it one diamond because I don't think people will want that as much. And if I start making Turtle Master, I'm going to make that two. Two diamonds a bottle. And if people want it in bulk, they can make deals with me and stuff. But I need to figure out how to translate that. Um, yeah. Now they can. Uh, regen should be more expensive. Like, three diamonds isn't enough, you think four? You're like the shady side quest at the back of the shop. <laughs> You're like a private eye. <laughs> I think I could make it four diamonds. I mean, if people will, are if people are willing to pay it, I'm willing to charge it. <laughs> this is why I don't own my own shops in real life because I think I would undercharge myself and I'd be okay with it because I'm. You'd be willing to pay it. All right. Well, if you're willing to pay it, you're like the ultimate. Um, you're like the ultimate. Um, like, what is it? Um, I don't know. The word is escaping me right now. Um, like judge of payment because if it's too expensive for you then I would trust that it would be too expensive in general I'll be honest actually wait I need this one apart I need this to be spread out so I trust your judgment space if you think it should be four diamonds a bottle it'll be four diamonds a bottle now where did that thing just go oh there it is okay boom done You watched a lot of The prices, Right? So did I. I just wasn't good at it. <laughs> I guess, like, you know, $1,000. It's like, no, it was three fifty. Like, oh, I just don't know how much things cost. That's great. Awesome. Wonderful. Perfect. Great. Fabulous. Oh, dear. All right. So, in any event. Um, so, yeah. Where were we? Where were we, peeps? So talk to me. What are you thinking about this build so far? Is there anything that I should consider tweaking? It, does it is does it feel like it's pretty much done, or is it missing something? When you walk into this space, I'm gonna I'm gonna come outside, right? I'm gonna walk outside. We're gonna walk through it. We're gonna walk through it, and I want you to tell me what you think. So, you walk in, you immediately know what it is. M says that Josh made her a tuna salad. That is delicious. Enjoy it. Uh, we had chili tonight. Um, and that's what took me a little longer for um, the stream to start, because chili takes a while, and Manatee wanted to make sure that I ate um, before, um, before I streamed. And we made dinner together, and it was nice. You know, apart from each other, but still. But yeah, so, okay, so you walk up, and you know exactly what this is. You know that this is going to be a coffee shop of some sort. Then you walk in, and this is the coffee shop. So you have the jukebox playing music on the left. You have people borrowing books on the right. You've got some tables and chairs for people to just sit back and enjoy the music. And I realize that all of the chairs are situated the same way, but that's because they're all facing the stage that I ha that I made up in the front. I might actually put a sign out front that says open mic night every every Wednesday or something like that. Just for the heck of it. You know, I can't make one of those sandwich boards, so I figured that would be the next best thing. So you know, you walk around, you know, people can borrow books from the, the bookshelves over here. And again, I am thinking of a fireplace. I am. Which might actually be, um, which I might actually put here. I might actually take this down and make it a fireplace and, and cover this up with, um, with nether brick. Not the, the not the, 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 not the red nether brick, the regular one. But again, I'm not exactly sure. Part of me thinks that this should stay as is. Because it's already hot enough up here as it is. I mean, it's the nether, for Pete's sake. It doesn't need to be any hotter. Then, you you know, you see the... Um, you see the... Um, the bar, where all the baristas and everything can walk around. And a little bit of that Vex magic to tie it into the front. Right? Tying it into the front. Um, and then here's the stage for people to perform 
utilizing that green Victorian wallpaper that Sixie sold us last stream to kind of break up the darkness of that wall. And the mic the wither skull um, armor stand combo for the microphone for the people to perform. How is that looking? What do y'all think about that? I think it's perfect. Um, like I said, there's obviously a few little things that have to get done to it, like putting in like when what prices are and stuff, like a little price guide. Um, oh, you know what? That's what I should do. That's what I should do. I should do a price guide, like a menu. Yes, that's what I'm going to do instead of having signs everywhere. Hold on. Hold on. We're doing this. We're doing this right now. We're doing this right now. Space says that for them, the mic is lime green, so it matches the paper. Oh, that's different. Okay. So you walk in and maybe there'll be a little sign like right here or I could put, hold on. Oh, I can do that. Yes, yes, yes. See menu in barrel below. Hold on. See menu in, hold on. I gotta figure this out. Hold on one second. In barrel below for pricing. Doop. Okay. So I'm gonna, I'm going to need white dye, white or light blue dye. Actually, white is gonna work just, white's gonna work just fine. Let me go grab a white dye. Yes. All right, everybody. Count of three. We're gonna come inside. We're gonna watch everybody perform. Snap the fingers. Oh, this jam tracks so much. So good. This is so good. Oh my gosh. Okay, so here we go. Here we go. We're gonna get that white dye, right? And then Oh, come on, you can do it. Boop. Okay. See menu in barrel below for pricing. So this barrel, I'm going to keep empty. So all this stuff is going to come out of it. So slow falling in strength. That is... It doesn't show you what the what's what it is. That's... Oh, why doesn't it do that? It doesn't tell you what it is. So that's strength too. So potion of strength. And this is also strength too. So one goes there and then one goes in the container. Okay, good. Now slow falling and night vision are on the other side. This one's slow falling. And then night vision. Night vision, I think. Uh, night vision should be here. So hold on, night vision. Now, if I didn't know any better, I would just put the menu, like, right here, or put an item frame with the menu. Hold on. No. Wait. Hmm. Because if you can shift-click a sign on the cauldron, you should be able to shift-click the item frame onto the cauldron, too. And then I could put the menu the beverage menu on the cauldron. Yeah, that's what I'm going to do. This was a good idea, but if I have an, I don't have an extra item frame. I don't. So that's not a problem. I know that I brought extra leather. I have extra leather. I just have to remember where the heck I put it. So apparently tonight's stream is brought to you by the phrase, Lil can't find her stuff. 
<laughs> Dorito is asking me what the what the cafe is going to be called. Um, where it's going to be called? That is a really good question. Because at this moment in time, I am not a, I am not remotely sure. Wait, no, I have spruce. M says I should call it Lil NJ. No, I'm not gonna call it that. I'm not gonna call it that. Um, I don't, I don't want it to be called anything. I don't really want it to be called anything NJ. Um, part of me thought of just calling it the Nether Mug Cafe. And just keep it very simple, like that. Hmm. Oh, I have more fire resist up here. Uh, well, no, I'm gonna hold one. Oh, I have light blue carpet. Perfect. I want that. Gimme. Now, you all saw me... You all saw me grab... Lots of leather, right? I mean, I'm not hallucinating. I know I grabbed it. Where the hell did I put it? And remind me to feed my cat later. Where the hell did I put that? Did I put it in the ender chest? Like, what the hell? Oh wait, no, I dumped a bunch of garbage in one of these chests. I know I did. I think I- I thought I did. <sighs> Space, what did I do with all that leather? I didn't use it all. Where did I put it? All right, now, all right, I'm going to check my ender chest because I'm, 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 <laughs> I'm annoyed. I'm annoyed that I can't find it. Uh, I'm going to stick the fire resist potion in here for now. Where? Why can't I find it? If anyone knows what I did with my leather, can someone tell me, please? Because I don't know what I did with it, and I'm... I'm, I just, I feel dumb. Oh, for Pete's sake. That's a mouthful, M. What did I do with all that leather? I mean... You all saw me with that leather. I brought a whole stack of leather, and I didn't use the whole stack. Hi, Yergi. Welcome to the stream. We're playing NJ Loses Everything again. Oh! Hi, Mother of Corgis. Welcome to the stream, and thank you for being my 200th follower. <laughs> we hit 200! <laughs> We hit 200! <laughs> and I found my leather! Yay! <laughs> oh my gosh, it's such a good night. Oh, thank you so very much. How are you doing, Mother of Corgis? It's nice to see you. I hope you're well. Oh my gosh. Yay! Oh, thank you so much. Oh, good grief. Okay. Oh. You hear my name on other streamer streams all the time, so you're excited to catch me? Oh, that's sweet. Thank you. Um yeah, I I I chat a lot. Um when it's quiet at work, you know, I watch 
impulse and skiz and um and you know i'm in joe hill's you know like i'm hit i'm in his chat all the time and stuff um yeah <laughs> but i'm very happy to have you um skiz impulse and joe yeah those are the three that i'm that i'm most frequently in like even yesterday um i raided skiz which i've never done before um because he usually streams like okay so he, he and impulse usually stream while I'm still at work and I usually watch them on the train on the way home yeah he was streaming when impulse of tango was streaming and I actually didn't know that he was streaming I didn't know because I I went to look to see who was on and I usually if if impulse and tango have you know like a a lot of people I, I I I look for smaller streamers like I'll raid my friend Kaylina I'll raid Genesis Dark I'll raid Liara I'll I'll raid anyone who you know doesn't have 1500 people because a they're usually my friends or I know them or they're actually my real life friends or um I've watched enough of their content to appreciate it and I just want to like give back because they'll raid me and that's great. And so when I raided Skiz last night, he said to me that he had seen in their Discord, because they have a fan Discord that Bunny Bond started, um, he saw that I was streaming, but he wants to follow me on stream. He doesn't want to do it offline. He wants people to see it, apparently. And that's what he said on stream. He's like, I want to do that while you're actually live. I want to watch you in action. And I'm just like, um, okay. <laughs> so I'm just going, oh my god, you know? Um, and I say it like that because um, because both he and Impulse are part of the reason, and, and Joe actually, are part of the reason why I play Minecraft. And, um, I'm, I'm reading all your comments. Hold on. <laughs> Hold on one second. Uh, I'm telling stories. Um, actually, um, yeah, actually, wait, because this, mm, this and that, and then to there and there. Yeah, I think that, that, that looks good. We'll put one there, and one there, and one there. We'll just fill this all up with fatigue mats, that's fine. Beautiful, I love it. Love it, love it, love it. This looks so good. Oh my god, I can't even right now. Um, so, yeah, um, uh, where was I? Yeah, so, so basically, um, you know, they, I started watching when they were doing Naked and Scared, and Hermitcraft, and all this other stuff, and that's how... I, like through my husband, that's how I got involved in Minecraft and why I wanted to play and in meeting Joe in person, um, getting to know him and talking to him about Minecraft and Wells Knight and stuff like, and Python. Um, they got me interested in it, even though I never was really, I never considered myself a creative person or a builder or anything like that. And the reason why I stream is because of Joe, because one night on stream, he, he, he called me out and he said you know do you and manatee gag that's my husband like do you guys stream and we're like um no no and he said well you should i think you'd be really good at it and so i went okay i've been challenged i'm gonna actually look into this because why not um so i spent a month researching obs and dream labs and trying to figure out what worked and everything like that and I found something that worked for me and I started streaming and it I was a mess in the beginning and you know now I'm used to it and I've it's given me a chance to kind of tap into some things and some some skill sets that I haven't used in a long time uh, like when I was a radio DJ for co in my college I was a college DJ and so I I tap into a lot of those skills um, to do this and I'm not the only person who is a, was a DJ from college that actually streams my friend Gil he lives in Italy um, he streams 
United 101, welcome to the stream. You have a question. I have an answer. Fire away. And I still like Nether Roof Cafe. I want cafe to be part of the name. What's your question, United? Is it yeet time? Um, quite possibly, it depends on what's being yeeted. I don't like balcony bean. I'm not feeling that. I don't like it. It doesn't, it does, it feels like it doesn't fit. Um, I'm sorry. I mean, it, it, it works in other places, but maybe the balcony, see the bean cafe, bean cafe could be over in the pub. Like I could see that in the pub, but not, not for this. I, I want this to be more like a like a beatnik cafe and I guess I think that's probably where you're getting bean from because I, it, it feels like a beatnik cafe so that's why that's that nether mug cafe is very just like uh, it hits the head nether quartz cafe eh, no because I I only used nether quartz on the saucer I didn't use it I used white concrete for the build and yes Yergi this is the inside of the mug this is the inside of the mug Nether Mug Cafe. That's what it's going to be. The Nether Mug Cafe. I'm sorry if you don't like it. But now I have to... But you see, now... Now I have to go find a spot and build a cafe on a balcony. Because the, the literalness of it is would work. But I... I for this space, it doesn't fit, but I could build another space for it. And it would it would fit. You're welcome, United 101. I'm glad you're here. I hope you stick around. Um something off of Yeah, exactly. Something off of a cliff. Like there there are there are big big mountain things. I could build a cafe in a, on a big big mountain. Maybe I'll do that. Maybe I'll do that in seven of mine. I think maybe I'll do that there. But I'm... But... Yeah. But far enough away so that it wouldn't interfere with the other potion shops. Do you perchance have a music disc on you? Um, no, I don't. I don't play the music discs because for the most part they, um, they upset my ears. But the one that you played before works just fine and it doesn't bother me. Okay, so I am going to... Where's the... Um, let's see. I'm going to put this there. One of them is missing. Um, er, is it in the jukebox? No, I seriously don't have it. There are mountains between our bases. Oh, over in, um, over in, um, SOM? Okay. Thanks, space. I could build it outside the spruce of truce. Sure, I could do that. Okay. So, we have basically accomplished a lot in these last two hours. Excuse me. Um, but first and foremost, for those of you who just popped in, my name is NJ Coffee Junkie. Everyone calls me NJ, Coffee, or Coffee Junkie for short, and I am coming to you from the great state of New Jersey. Um, you are currently joining me on the Joe Hills pa Patreon realm, the Legacy Realm, um, which is a server that was started, or a realm that was started, um, when Hermitcraft Season 6 started and was recently retired when season seven started. So anyone who is a new patron of Joe Hills is not whitelisted for this realm, but for a new realm that he created at the be for the be to mark the beginning of season seven. Um, this is one of my, this is my latest build that I started before the new server was established. And it's the inside of 
my nether roof mug, which I have named the, which, uh, the cafe, I have christened the nether mug cafe. And this is basically the nether mug. Um, I used white concrete and light blue terracotta, um, end rods and iron doors for, um, the, the mug itself. The handle is with a uh, light blue terracotta. For the saucer, I used primarily white concrete, white and light blue carpet. And for the center where the mug is sitting, I used nether quartz slabs. The saucer took three separate tries to construct it because I built the damn thing too big the first two times because my math was a little off. Once I redid the numbers and corrected it, I was able to fix it. Uh, the saucer is 64 blocks wide. The mug itself is 32 blocks wide on the inside. And when you come inside, we have a stage, we have tables and chairs, we have the coffee bar. Um, there is one final thing that I need to do besides stock the bar, which I don't necessarily have to do right now. Um, but that is to write the menu. I have to write the menu and let people know when they come in how much everything's going to cost. So that's basically what I'm doing, I'm going to do right now. So I have the book, right? And I have the, um, I have the list of prices. Now the thing is, I can't sign the book until I make sure that all of the different potions are in it. Um, I have to make sure that if I'm going to sign it, I have to write, you know, I have to put in all the different potions. So that's going to take a couple of minutes. So we're going to do this. We're going to do this. Um, what not let me, oh, I'm a ding ding. I'm a dork. I forgot. I need to go get an ink and quill. That's my bad. And I don't, I know for a fact that I don't have that up here. So I have rockets and I, I have the ender chest that I'm going to return to my base because I can get the ink and the quill at my base. So we're going to take a field trip really quick. Whee. I know we were already there before, but we're going back. And where's the way out? Oh, it's over here. Okay, good. Good, 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 good. We're going on a field trip, everybody. Come along. Um, this way. Because we have to go back through the seaport. Oh, Yergi! Thank you so much for the sub with Twitch Prime. You're such a sweetheart. Thank you. I appreciate that so much. I do. Oh, so Mother of Corgis, I realize you've never seen this before. Um, let me show you. Let me show you around real fast. Um, so this is the seaport. Um, my base is over here this way. So, hold on, let me... You're loving it? Oh, I'm so glad. I'm so glad. And yeah, Yergi, thank you so very much. You're such a sweetheart. I appreciate you so much. All right, so come on, let's take a let's take a trip. I'm halfway to oh, unlocking another em emote. That's awesome! Yay! Um, so we're gonna hop into the squid farm first. I just need one ink. So, boop. I have to remember how far down it is. I think it's all the way down. Oh, yep. Oh, wait. I think I went too far. Did I go too far? Um, I just need one, one ink sack. Um, our, um, our ink farm is basically free, but just take only what you need. Yurgi says that they love it here. They're so glad I was convinced to stream. Well, yeah, I mean, I seriously am very grateful, um, because I'm streaming from a space that, you know, I don't necessarily have to be given permission to stream from. And that's one of the things that I love so much about in, about the encouragement that I've been getting is that um, 
it's encouraged for me to do this. And I have to say that that Joe has been so supportive. Um, I mean, he's rated me in everything. Um, and he, and, and not just me, but there are like 15 of us who stream. And yeah, he is. Um, this is the cup of Joe prank that was played on me. Vin Shoken, another name you might be familiar with, Mother of Corgis. Um, it's literally signs that just say Joe. It's a coffee mug that's full of Joe. It's hilarious. I'm the one that gets pranked on this server all the time, by the way. So, just as an FYI, if when you follow my streams, someone always pranks me at almost every single time. The fact that I haven't been pranked yet is ridiculous, but also a relief. Um, this is my base. Um, it's for a bookstore that I built as a birthday present for Joe. Um, it's called Yarns and Jobel. So it, it has looms for people to make banners. And it also sells bookcases. Yeah, you, me and Fally, I know. <laughs> and his thousand, uh, his, his base full of torches that Strange put there. Um, my base is technically um, the second floor of this book, of this bookstore. Because um, it's kind of based on where I grew up. The kind of house that I lived in. And the kind of houses in my neighborhood. Um, I lived in something called a row house. So at least that's what I think it's called. Where the houses are built so close to one another. Like almost right on top of each other. And so this looks like a Barnes and Noble, in a sense, um, but it's also like the houses on my main street where the business is at the bottom. She said, Mother of Corgi says, girl, I am from Philly. I grew up in a row home too. Well, I'm from, I'm from Jersey. I've been to Philly. Philly is beautiful and you know exactly what I'm talking about. So you, you know that, like, you know the storefronts were on the bottom floor and all the apartments and everything else were on, up top. That's exactly what this is. Now, granted, my house wasn't, didn't have a storefront. It was a full house, but you still pick up what I'm putting down. You understand me. You get me. See, I'm glad you're here because we're on a wavelength here. We're good. Um, but to contrast that, I also run a farm sort of. This is my farmer's market. Like, you know the pop-up farmer's markets that you see every summer? They, like, they put up a couple of tents and people sell their produce and stuff? That's where I got this idea from. So this is a pop-up farmer's market that's you around. And I got Joe Bob over here keeping an eye on my wares. But basically I sell, like, meat. Like, chicken and beef and leather and stuff like that. And then over here, real quick, because I gotta get a feather from my chickens. This is Mascot Farms. This is a silo that is empty right now, um, but these are my mascots, Fudgy and Pinchy. Um, these are real life ma stuffed animal mascots that my husband and I take with us when we visit the student, the college students that we work with. Um, they, the students love them and they come with us um, pretty much all the time. Um, and then the, these are my lag babies. So these are all my cows and chickens. So now I have the ink sack. I need a feather. And with their powers combined, I ha can make a book and quill. So now I have the book and quill that I need. And I don't know why there isn't music playing. Go figure. I didn't turn the music down. Uh, we can head back to the nether mug. And we'll fill out that book. And that should allow us to open the cafe for business. But first, you know what? I'm going to run into the pub real fast and grab some supplies. Because I own a shop here too. Mal set it up for me. So I need at least one speed. Space says that they're looking forward to seeing if I notice something new when I watch the VOD through. I haven't had time to watch my VODs through lately, and if you haven't noticed, I need to actually upload. Um, let's see. Oh, invisibility. Someone remind me to make more invisibility potion. Slow falling we have, poison we have. I'll grab a weakness. I'll grab one of these. Oh, I... 
Prank juice. Yes, prank juice. I still need to take a look at the Viewtopia location. In terms of building the, the thing you wanted me to do? I haven't forgotten about that. That's next on the list. Obviously, it's not going to start tonight. Maybe tomorrow, but... Um, okay, let's get back to the Nether Cafe. What did you do to the Nether Cafe space? Because I, I figured you were going to prank me somehow. I know you well enough to know that, but... Uh-huh. Uh-huh. I know you. What did you do that everybody's going to snicker about in five seconds? Oh, you built the cafe. You built the, the bakery already. Okay. Well, yeah, I will come take a look. I'm scared now, Space. What did you do? I hate when I'm oblivious. Yeah, I'm also oblivious as hell, mother of corgis. I am terrible. <laughs> but that's why they that's why they like pranking me so much, because I don't pick up on stuff. Okay, what did you do? Alright. Nothing. <laughs> <laughs> what did you do? I mean, all my crap's still here. Yeah, see? Th these are the mascots I was telling you about, Mother of Corgis. That's an actual picture. Um, Sixie's, um... Yeah, Sixie is the master cartographer for us. And so, um, they took a picture that looks exactly like that. And it... it I had it commissioned. And... It was perfect. I can't even tell you just the level of detail. I seriously thought they just handed me a picture. That is literally the picture I gave them. That is literally the picture I gave them. A couple of streams ago, maybe about two or three months ago, um, we spent the time to tear it down so that they could work on their next commission. And I just looked at it and went, sweet baby hamsters, you know what I mean? It was just bananas. All right, hold on. I need to find an empty chest because I'm just going to deposit all this stuff in here. For now. I mean, obviously, I have to sort it out and that stuff, but let's see. So now we have... We have to make an item frame, which we don't have enough... Oh! Hi, Dom! Thanks for the raid. My thingy didn't ping, but I see you. How are you doing? Yay, welcome raiders. Dix erects, um, oh, cute. Uh, 658, Pyro Burnham, Domino. Welcome, welcome. Hi, everybody. Hi, Jazz. Oh, thanks for the follow, 658. I appreciate it. You're gonna have to be sneaky now. Random me guy. Thank you. Thank you for the follow. I appreciate it. Welcome everybody. Come on in. Get yourself settled. Chumpy lizard. Oh my gosh. All these new follows. Thank you so much. Chumpy lizard. How? Dragon new light. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you so much. How's everybody doing tonight? Welcome. How was your stream, Domino? I caught, um, hi Star Galaxy 1234. I caught a little bit of it. Um, because right when you started, um, I was like, oh, Domino's streaming. That's great, you know? And then my coworker called me. My coworker called me to tell me um, that I will be working from home um, for the foreseeable future. I had already started this week working three days, but he's like, yeah, so, yeah. <laughs> Jeez, all the people. You brought them with you. Thank you. And thanks for the follow, that RSC. I, I, I'm grateful. Thanks a lot. Um, I, so many, so many new names. Um, so I'm NJ Coffee Junkie. Hold on. I'm going to like turn around so I can introduce myself here to you. Hi. Hello. Um, I'm NJ Coffee Junkie. Um, I am a patron of Joe Hills and I am coming to you from his legacy Patreon realm. Um, I am in the middle of building a nether cafe, um, on our nether roof. So let me show you real, real quick. Real quick. And then Domino, I want to hear all about your stream. Um, so this is our nether hub roof. Our um, Joe, our demiurge, blew a hole in it one night because he could. 
uh, cause he has that capability. And he said, well, it's free real estate. Go and build it. Um, you thought this was Fallycraft. No, uh, I'm part of Fallycraft, but I haven't streamed from there in a while. This is a Patreon realm, uh, for Joe Hills of Hermitcraft. Um, so yeah, he blew a hole in it, and so he said it's free real estate, so go ahead and build it. Oh, you're following him too? Yeah, he, isn't he great? Um, so I built this. This is my nether mug cafe. It's called the nether mug cafe. Um, and I used white concrete and light blue terracotta. The saucer is 64 blocks wide, and it's made of white concrete, nether quartz slabs for the center, and then white and light blue carpet with, with end rods for some light. And this is what we've been working on for the last two streams, this interior. So we have spruce. Yeah, Domino. Um, I finally finished the exterior and um, I managed to start the interior. And so for the last two streams, no, three streams, um, I've been working on the interior. Um, Jay Schlatt would like this? Nice. Yeah, so we have the stage for people to perform. We have the, the cappuccino bar, the coffee bar here. Um, this is all stuff that we pretty much did today and last stream. But before I forget, hold on, where did I put my um, scaffolding? Space, do you have scaffolding on you? You know what? No, hold on. I'm going to do this this way. Because I have... I have white wool. Hold on. No, it's fine. I'm going to use wool. I can't find my scaffolding. I've been misplacing stuff all over. But, um, let me come up a little higher so you can see. Probably. It's fine. But yeah, this is the, uh, the cappuccino art on the top. I thought that would look really cool. Oh, uh, thanks, Star Galaxy. I appreciate that. Yeah. So I did this all free, free form. No, um, yeah, I do that a lot, Jazz. I, 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 I just get so hyper-focused that I'm just blind. It's fine. <laughs> Uh-oh. Hi, Dorito. Yeah, I saw the scaffolding. It's fine. Um, has Elytra still pillars? Yeah. Oh, Mother of Corgis, thank you for the subscription. That's very sweet. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Um... But this is why you like me so much, because I forget things, and I just improvise, and then I remember them later and go, oh, derp. <laughs> but yeah, I freeformed this, except the, um, except the at sign in the middle. I kind of really tried to, to work on that, and I used brown and, um, I used brown and white carpet for that. So we're going to come back down. It's going to take a minute, so apologies for that. Uh, when you guys all popped in, I was literally just about to put the finishing touches. We just came back from my base because our ink farm is right next to where my base is. I needed to get an ink and quill for a book because um, we're going to put the menu prices in for the different potions that I'm going to sell. Um, so I have strength, speed, healing, basically all of them. And I'm there is going to have to be some brewing that's going to happen um, because this is a new shop and I have to stock it. Um, but it's gonna it'll take some time and that's fine. Um, I was asked to build this by my server mates because with all this open real estate, they had said to me, well, you should really open a shop up here. And I said, okay, well, what kind of shop do I want to build? Because a lot of my builds are very coffee-focused. Um, I kind of stick on brand, <laughs> I guess. Um, so I wanted to do something really big. My, my server mates do stuff that's just huge and gorgeous and just so big. And so I said, I really want to do something that's large and that takes a while and stuff like that. And 
I had this idea to build, make a cappuccino mug. You know, those big, wide mugs that you get at the coffee shops, like the mom and pop shops, the really big ones. And so I have a mug like that in the house, and I used that as my inspiration. And I just, I went at it. And I started, I started going at it and doing it. Um, so I need sticks. I don't have enough sticks because I need one more item frame. And I threw some wood in here. Spruce planks are perfectly fine. And my crafting bench. What did you do? Space said they pranked me and I'm not going to figure out how. Because I get pranked so often here, it's not funny. I picked it up earlier. Oh, that's right. I did. Thank you. I knew it was here somewhere. But, yeah, Domino, if you're still here, um, um, can someone do a shout out for Domino, please? Um, how was your stream? What did you, um, what did you end up working on today? If you need anything to upgrade your stream, let me know and I'll donate. Um... See, I appreciate that. I say I appreciate that a lot because I mean it, but um, I don't necessarily need anything right now. I basically, um, I stream from my laptop in my living room. My husband is in our office right now and he's playing Minecraft too, probably. He's been working on a wool farm or something like that. Villagers are I'm not sure. He was building something with that had creepers in it yesterday. Um, we're looking to move me into the office. So that means eventually um, getting a proper microphone with a pop screen. And I have a stream deck. I haven't used it yet because it's on my laptop. Um, I have to figure out how to put the how to set up the buttons and 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 organize all that stuff eventually I want to get a nice gaming chair and all that other stuff because um, I really enjoy streaming I really do and it's gonna take some time and right now I'm good but eventually I I'm going to put I'm going to work towards those things um, I do um... <laughs> spaces they're gonna sing a new version of lines um, after almost 13 hours of streaming, hi rated you, uh, you rated me. So Dom says, we started the stream today by finishing the mob farm by putting a proper collection system in it. Then we jumped at the end for two hours, making an on-off switch for the public Enderman farm, as well as Ender Pearl disposal collection. Then spent some time getting a shulker of golden carrots, as well as a shulker of rockets. Then probably spent another six hours making an iron farm from start to finish. Good grief. Good grief. Dom. Your stamina is legendary. That is bonkers. I, uh, I applaud you. See? Whee! I applaud you for 13 hours because that is just nuts in a good way. And you got so much done. I commend you. This, we've been going at this for like two and a half hours, and most of this stuff was already here. I've spent most of the last two and a half hours just talking. You not noticing my mischief is astounding, too. Well, because I'm reading chat. I'm trying to catch you and reading chat. I can't do both. You're like messing with all my stuff, and it's fine. It's totally fine. All right, where was I? So I put the... See, space has me all distracted. Dom says playing games is how he relaxes, and that's good stuff. Um, that's how we relax, too. Um, and also, it's a good way for us to do the whole social distancing thing, because um, he's in the other room and I'm in here. And we're really actually like keeping ourselves um, separated a little bit, my husband and I. Uh, I like. I mean, we still like... 
you know, like we're in the same space, like he'll be on one couch, I'll be on the other or whatever. But yeah, it's really tough. Uh, since you raided me in the last like 10 minutes, you got nine stacks of iron. Good grief. Space is excited because they haven't been able to Minecraft in forever because, um, well, yeah, you haven't been able to because your computer was busted and now it's fixed and we're all happy to have you back. And you think you see what space did. What did space do? I'm now curious. Okay, so that wasn't messed with. I'm actually, look I'm legitimately looking around now to see what you messed with. <laughs> like... It wouldn't be a stream of mine if I didn't get pranked somehow. So the fact that the fact that they're talking about me being pranked is nothing new. Okay. So, all right. So, so Dom, let me walk you through this real quick. Um, so like I said, this is the bar and I have this Vex magic, if you will. Um, I have this posted so that people can see the brewing stands because like if whether you, oh, do a slow scan of the room. Okay. Hold on. Okay, so you come in, right? And this is the first thing you see. You see this big room, you see all the tables and chairs. The random carpet is just to prevent gas from spawning. And then over here, I'm gonna start here. You see the jukebox. Um, the left chest is full of garbage, I have to clear it out. The right has all the discs in it. And then you see the map of my mascots, Fudgy and Pinchy. They are real life stuffed animal ma mascots that I take with me. Um, my server mate, Sixie, did a, this map that I had commissioned from them for that. Then you come over to. Sorry, I'm going to try and go slow. Uh, you come over to this side, and this is basically a library book return area because some cafes they do like bring a book, borrow a book. And so I wanted that same as I wanted that same idea. So this is where people would come in and return books. I had a book in that chest. I'm using it for the menu, right? Then um, I have paintings all along the wall. I have two parallel bookshelves on either side. Um, then up front, just like any other like beatnik kind of cafe, because I mean we're on the nether roof, so. Beatnik Cafe, yes please. Um, we have a little stage here that's all done in uh, wood slabs and Victorian wallpaper maps for the green, for the screen in the background. And then this is the mic so people can, you know... Oh, shoot. I didn't mean to do that. Testing. One, two, three. Testing. So they can, like, you know, sing and stuff like that. And all this time... I have a glass bar. The glass is light blue um, to match the outside aesthetic because um, this is a very warm inviting space and I wanted this part to kind of be bright a little bit, not too much. That's what the black carpet's for. The black carpet's to kind of mute that brightness a little bit. And then there are light blue fatigue mats for all the, for all the workers and all the baristas and bartenders to be able to walk around. All of the wares are going to be in the the barrels over here, and then any good bar, you know, has um, has an area for glass the glass bottles to be washed and stuff. And of course, no um, no store is um, complete without an under chest. So that's the under chest. Um, I could have put it underneath. But I didn't want to. I wanted the particles to be able to be seen. And the last thing in here that needs to be done, because we've done basically everything else so far between this stream and the last one, is to fill out the menu. So all of my other shops have signage uh, that basically says what I sell and how much it is and whatever. But for this, I think a menu would be more apt. A, because it's less cluttered, and B, because if, let's say, if I was actually here and someone came in and sat down 
then I would be able to just take the menu and give it to them and they'd be able to like read it and figure it out and then then boom, done and dusted. And they'd be able to, you know, figure out how much everything was. So I that's kind of where that's kind of where we are now is I was just about to write the menu out. Um, I used spruce for the majority of the build because I had so much of it. The tables and chairs are dark oak. Um, the tabletops are black carpet. Um, the carpet that's covering the bookcases and the two pillars by the front by the doors, that is um, that is brown carpet. Um, again, just to prevent ghasts from spawning. Um, because while I was constructing this, especially during the saucer portion, um, if I stepped away for a minute or what have you, if I had even one area that was not protected, um, ghasts would spawn. I mean, the pigment spawning wasn't a big deal, but ghasts would spawn, and that just would drive me nuts. And I've died two or three times because of... Uh, not paying attention and having spawnable spaces for ghasts. And you can actually hear them. Uh, they're over by the gold farm. So they'll fly up by the gold farm and then come down when they know you're AFK because the gold farm is just far enough away that um, it's, it's that it's just that far enough away where they'll know you're there and they'll pathfind to you. And I can't tell you how annoying it is to be pathfound. <laughs> You know what I mean? So it's like, uh, here we go, you know? So that's, that's where we are. So I have the, um, book and quill. That's what we were going to get when you came in. Like we had just come back from that. Uh, so we just have to write this out. So welcome to the nether roof cafe. Dom says, it's 5 a.m., and I'm going to see if I can make it to my bed before I pass out. Bye-bye. Good night, Dom. Get some rest. Thank you for the raid. Thank you for bringing your community here. I hope that your sleep is restful and that I catch you during your next stream. And great job with all the stuff you did today. I am, like, floored at how much progress you got done. Have an awesome night, Dom. Thanks. Okay, so welcome to the Nether Roof Cafe. We are here to quench your thirst. Oh, hi, Adam Wesley. Welcome. Welcome to the stream. Good to see you. How are you doing tonight? We are here to quench your thirst in a variety of ways. Check out our choices on the following pages. And, nope, and let our baristas know what you would like. Yes, nether mug, not nether roof. What was I thinking? Thank you, thank you, M. Nether mug. Nether mug cafe. There we go. Fixed. Fixed. You can tell it's late. Okay, welcome to the nether mug cafe. We are here to quench your thirst in a variety of ways. Check out, um, hold on. We need to double space that check out our choices on the following pages and let our baristas know what you would like all right so since this is a coffee bar I have the coffee I have the coffee names right over here so let's see let's see what we got all right so we have Fleet Foot Brew. Would help if I could spell. That's speed. Regular. Regular is um, one. One diamond bottle. Then the red eye which is the eight minute one. Eight minute. That's also one diamond per bottle. 
Actually, I don't like the capital like that. I, the lowercase works just fine. Wow. And then there's the bold. Bold roast. Actually, no. Bold. Wait. Extra strength. Hmm. I'm going to call that iced. Iced, because it's I, for one. And then we'll call it, um, no. Dang it! Eh, that's fine. Uh, no, I'm sorry. I, uh, wait a minute, hold on, no, no. We're going to call that regular. And then we're going to call this iced because I already have a bold roast and I, and yes, I will go fix it in the, I will go fix it in the mall later. And so the iced is, um, two diamonds a bottle. All right. So there we go. So that's, that's the fleet foot. Now we have the espresso and that's, um, and that's strength. So a single shot, that's for one, one diamond a bottle, and then ristretto, which is the eight minute one. Um, ristretto actually makes sense for this particular, um, it makes sense for this particular um, item because a ristretto shot, a, restress, uh, a, a ristretto espresso shot, try saying that three times fast, um, is a, um, is a, is an, is an espresso shot that is poured over an extended period of time where, um, it, it doesn't lose the flavor. It's just the way it's, the way that it's brewed, the way that it's pressed, the way that it, the, the, there, it's a longer shot. Um, a lot of times when you make an espresso shot, um, it takes about, I think, 10 seconds to, to brew. And if you let it sit too long, that's how it ends up tasting really gross or burnt. You can always tell if a barista or, or whoever makes your coffee that they let the espresso sit too long if it doesn't, if it tastes burnt and not sweet. Not like super sickening sweet, like cloying sweet, but you just know. Um, but a ristretto shot allows for that length without, um, without it going sour. Um, and then a doppio, which is a double shot. That a doppio, I think, is Italian for double. So that's a level two. That is um, two diamonds per bottle. And I need that to be on the next line so that it fits. Okay, so that's espresso. Okay. So then we have bold roast, which is kind of like the regular coffee. And we want to make sure that this stays okay, so we're on, on the same line, and that's fine. And then we have the small, which is one, and that's one diamond. I should probably make this a cup, but it's fine. Large is two, and that's... Um, two diamonds a bottle. Oh, Adam, your birthday is um, this coming Friday? Next week, as in this next week? That's cool. Happy early birthday. Um, so what we could do here... Oh, happy early birthday. That's really cool. Do you know what you want to do? Is, I don't know if you're going to be able to do anything necessarily for it, but um, I hope that you're able to. Even if it's just having a little cake, that would be good. Um, all right, so, so we have strength, we have speed, and we have healing. Does anyone have the list that we made earlier tonight about the other, um, the other potions that we had to list? Um, so I know that I'm going to put the employee favorites. 
employee picks. You're getting dirt cake and your favorite dinner. What is dirt cake? Is that like a chocolate crumb cake or something like that? Employee picks. Night vision. Oh, I wish... Oh, that's really cool. It is a dirt cake. Um, um, chocolate cake. Um, uh, I don't remember. We, we had names for all these different things on Fallycraft, and I can't remember what they are. Oh, I think we called, um, I think we called Night Vision, uh, Insomnia Brew. Employee picks, um, two diamonds bottle. E yes. Uh, yeah, one second. Hold on. Um, uh, uh, what would we call that? Because we don't have a nickname for that, because on this realm, I call it antacid. What would we call that? Oh, I know. Steamer. Well, actually, no, because a steamer is technically milk. Um, but that's what it's called. Um, <sighs> hmm. All right, everybody, I need your thinking caps. What can we call fire resist? What can we call fire resist that fits in with with coffee? Hmm. I'm thinking about it right now. But I'm let's see. Something iced. Ooh, iced coffee. Good stuff. Good stuff. Good stuff. Iced coffee. Fire is. Okay. So we'll make... Ooh, cold brew. I like that better. And then insomnia blend. Beautiful. You guys are great. High fives all around. Hypes in chat, please. Because you guys are crushing it right now. Beautiful. It's perfect. It's so perfect. No, you're fine, Em. You're valid. You're good. Yay! Yes, you can. You can use the hype emote. Um, if, if for any reason you can't, then just raise, um, use the letter Y. Because it's like raising your hands up in the air. Um, okay, so we have... We're on page five. So we have bold roast. We have the employee picks. Because um, we also have invisibility. So we're going to do um, uh, house specials. And we're going to put um, two diamonds each. Um, wait, did I put capitals? No, I didn't. Okay. So two two diamonds a bottle. So we have um, invisibility, which I remember we nicknamed it the John Cena blend. I don't hold on. What can we call that? Now, I understand that some of you will not get the reference, and I apologize for that. <laughs> um, 
Some of you do get the reference, and I appreciate that so greatly. Hold on one second, because I just touched my eyes. I'm going to go grab some hand sanitizer. And we've been going for like... Oh god, we've been going for almost three hours. Oh. Oh dear. Okay. Hand sanitizer to the rescue. Okay. Okay. You never get the reference, but you're used to it. Okay, so Yergi, John Cena is a longtime professional wrestler um, for the WWE. And they, um, and they have something... They, their catchphrase is, you can't see me. The John Cena invisibility. Now, I'm going to stop here for a second and move around, because if I'm in the book too long, then I'm going to get... Then the, then the game's going to time me out and I'm going to get kicked out. And I'm going to lose all my progress. Um, okay. Hi, space. What did you do? I know you've been up to no good while I've been doing this. <gasps> I see that! <coughs> Dang you! <coughs> <coughs> no, I I started coughing right when I saw that. So, oh gosh, yeah, I'm getting some now. Oh gosh. Oh, terrible, terrible. My poor babies are upside down. Oh, I saw that. Okay. Anyway. Um, so back to the book we go, because we have to finish it, right? Just doing your chaotic lawful best. You never cease to amaze me, space. You never do. Okay. So let's see. All right. So, uh, let's come back over here and take that out. Welcome to the Nether Mug Cafe. We are here to quench your thirst in a variety of ways. Check out our choices on the following pages and let our baristas know what you would like. So we have the Fleetfoot Brew. We have Espresso. We have bold roast and employee picks. I'll share a video clip in your Discord after the stream if you haven't figured it out. I probably won't figure it out, and this stream's not going to last that much longer because it's after 12, and I told Manatee that it, I said, you know, stop me at 11.30 because I know I'm not going to pay attention to the time. I know I'm not going to. And I was absolutely right in that respect. And I'm laughing my head off. It's, it's quarter after 12. I'm going to get up for ZF anyway. It's fine. Um, so we have the house special, which is apparently neither did Manatee. No, because he's probably building, he's building something in the other room. And he's, you know, when he gets focused like I do, then it's game over for both of us. Because we're just like, oh, we're, we're, we're like totally into it right now. Finish the book and go to bed. Gee, that's what I'm trying to do. <laughs> All right. So we have, we have the John Cena. Um, we have, um, we've already mentioned night vision. We've mentioned invisibility. Um, um, let's see, the Splinter, which is Turtle Master, um, and that's what, that's what six, Sixty, Sixty and I, um, call it on Fallycraft, so might as well just keep it here, uh, that, Yergi says that they legit have friends who yell at them to go to sleep, and Space says that's their whole life, and yeah, it's a mood. For me, it's, for yesterday when I was streaming, I was going for like three hours and Manatee comes in the other room and he just looks at me and he points as in, he gives me the the universal sign of I'm hungry and then like rubs his tummy and says, let's eat. Um, and I went, oh, okay. Cause I, I had lost track of time cause I was so engrossed in putting this room together that uh, I, I completely had lost it. So I was like, um, okay. And so, yeah, he's like, yeah, you need to eat. You need to eat. And I went, yes, I do. I definitely need to eat. But I just, you know, I'd forgotten to do it. And so, like, we made dinner together, and we, you know, we had dinner and everything, and um, it was nice. It was really nice. And even tonight, like, um, we realized it was getting late, and I wanted to stream, and I had said, oh, well, you know, um let's do it, this, that, and the other thing, and, and he went off, and now, well, here I am, and, um, 
can by the way it's been so it's been a while can you throw up my information um like all my socials and stuff um i realized today that um as i finish this jazz says i'm yelling to me now to go to bed it's quarter past five same as dom i'll listen to myself then good night well thanks jazz i'm glad you stuck around for as long as you did i hope i see you again really soon um Thanks so much. Uh, thanks for that uh, space. I appreciate it. Um, but yeah, so um, I am um, trying to get all of my stream replays up. I realize I haven't put the last couple up because I've been basically streaming every day for the last couple of days straight. And I think that's probably what's going to end up happening for the foreseeable future is I'm probably going to end up streaming weekdays at 5 at this point because that just seems to be a good time, like between five and 5.30. Uh, Adam says, I'm sad I missed most of your stream. Oh, don't be sad. I, you know, I stream at all times and you're following me and you know, you get the little notification and you come in when you do, you, you come in when you can. And you know, if you can't be here for whatever reason, don't stress about it. Um, it's fine. You know, I'm going to tell you the same thing that the other streamers tell me is, you know, if you can make it, make it. And if you can't, don't. And if you're really tired, you need to sleep, then go to sleep. You know, that's that's just how it is. You just have to take care of yourself in that respect. Um, so we have uh, Invisibility Turtle Master and we have Water Breathing, which um, I think we just said was straight up water. But I will go look at that later. Later. Um, I will come up with something better than that soon. I'm not going to sign, um, I'm not going to sign the book yet. Um, so we have those three house specials and then we have, um, no caffeine, no problem. Oh wait, hold on. Got to go back. Water breathing and then black widow blend poison. a little asterisk that says drink at own risk there we go I forgot no caffeine no problem then we have um, we have decaf coffee that's uh, weakness one uh, one diamond bottle and then we have tea which is slow falling and that's two diamonds bottle Adam says that makes sense to my sister who always does the right thing or she thinks that on Minecraft she burnt your house down saying it was a fireplace Interesting. That's unfortunate. Um, let's see. The water I'm going to take out of here. I'm going to take that out because that's that's not coffee. So I'm going to put uh, water. Uh, water breathing. And that's going to be two diamonds a bottle. Mother of Corgi says the first house they ever built years ago, their kid burnt down trying to make a fireplace. Oh dear. Oh dear. That's, that's not good. Um, I've learned how to use campfires, um, to keep, bless you. I've, I've built, I've figured out how to build fireplaces to keep houses from burning down. Also, um, on this realm, we had fire tick turned off and if you're familiar with joe's uh episode 140 from season six you'll see what happens when we all agreed to ask for fire tick off and he went to go do it let's just say hilarity ensued and we all died a lot <laughs> 
Nergi says the addition of campfires makes building fireplaces a lot safer. You can still get a flame look with far less danger. Um, that's true. Um, I built one in Fallycraft, a big one, because it's for the Hufflepuff common room. Um, I was going to put one in here, but decided against it because it's the nether hub roof. It's probably already hot enough as it is. Uh, your little sister's only four. Well, she didn't know any better if she's only four years old. She's still figuring stuff out. So, be patient with her. Um, there was another... There was another... Um, oh, regeneration. That's right. Regeneration. Which is... Um, And regeneration is a lot more, so I'm going to put that at, um, hold on, that's going to be four diamonds bottle. Okay, so I need to think of a name for regeneration. Um, I need something here. Uh... What can I call that? Holy tea? No. No, because it's life-giving. It, it, it's rejuvenating, so no, I don't think that... I, I appreciate the thought. I, I dig it, but I don't think that's... I don't think that's gonna... I don't think that works for this. Um... Hmm. I don't think that works, but... I gotta think about it. Hmm. Holy tea. Sounds like an expletive from someone who is suddenly trying to lessen the intensity of what wanted to come out. <laughs> That's very true, Yuriki. That's very true. Um, oh, hi, Trilly. Welcome to the stream and thank you for the biddies. 20 bits. Oh, bless you. Thank you so much. How are you tonight, my dear? How's everything? I'm trying to think of a coffee-themed coffee, fuel, coffee -themed name for regeneration, and I'm kind of stumped. Um, I'm, uh, I'm stumped on it, and it's the last thing that we were going to do tonight before I go to bed. I didn't... I should probably put it on its own page, come to think of it. Hmm. Breakfast blend. No, I don't want to copy something that's already out there. Um, I don't necessarily want to copy something that's out there. Like, obviously, words in Italian are fine. Um, something that's across the board is fine. Like, actual terminology is fine. But that that one is stumping me. Because I've never made it before. I just made it. Um, I, lit I just made it. Dark roast? Oh, well, I have... You know what? Yeah. Yeah. That's what we're going with. Dark roast. Well, Vita... Dark Vita. Well, thanks, Google. Dark Vita. Dark Vita Roast. Regeneration. Four diamonds a bottle. Should I put that on a different page? Because I want people to know that it's more expensive because it's harder to come by. Because it is technically a house special. So. Oh, you know what? Here. So if I do that and then that. Actually, wait. That and then do this. Actually, not that. That's not good. We want that. And then spell it out. Um, wait, hold on. Take this out. 
move this down one and then have four diamonds a bottle and then have it like that does that look okay so wait i'm gonna have to take this and then space it out like that and then like that and then that'll work Yeah, because the pages only allow so much. The, only so much space. Hmm. I think that'll be okay. Because on the next page we have no caffeine, no problem, decaf, tea, and water. And that's it so far. So let's see. And please let me know if I'm missing one. We have speed, we have strength, we have instant health, fire resist, insom um, night vision, that's five, invisibility, Turtle Master, Poison, Regen, Weakness, Slow Falling, Water Breathing. That's 12. I think that's everything. Night Vision's in there. It's called Insomnia Blend. Night Vision is... Night vision is here. I think that's, I think that's it. It is expensive. Um, it's exp well for this surfer, it's not because everyone has diamonds. Hmm. On the new server, on the new server, it's not. It's not. At least it won't be. Yeah, everyone has diamonds. They're easy to come by. I mean, if you look at what I have, I have I have at least a hundred diamonds on me. Not on me, like, like in my chest. In my ender chest, I have a, about 100. And I've only mined maybe 15 of them. Because they're not that hard to come by. I don't know. I don't know if someone printed diamonds. But I counted 12. Wiki is showing 15. Which ones am I missing? Yergi. Can you tell me? Because I want to, um, okay, we need to compare. All right, so hold on. You have the wiki up. I'm going to put the wiki up. Let's see. Potions in Minecraft. Um, there might be some that are only bedrock, um, that are only bedrock ones. So hold on, let's see what we got. Because this is the last thing we're doing before I, I sign off. So let's see what we have. We have Potion of Healing, which, oh, okay. So Potion of Healing, I don't have. Oh wait, no, yes I do, because it's instant health. Yes, that's, I have that. Fire resistance, I have that. Regen, yes. Strength, yes. Swiftness, that's speed. So n I have that. Night vision, yes. Invisibility. Okay, so leaping is the only one I don't have. 
Leaping and harming. Wait, hold on. Leaping, harming, and slowness are the only ones I don't have. So that's probably where those the, where the three out of the fifteen come from. Exactly. Um, I refuse to kill bunnies, so I will. I won't have leaping. Also, the fact that um, the fact that um, hold on, I have to get out of the book so I can so I don't so I don't time out. Um, harming is expensive to make, and I don't. I wouldn't want to make it because I don't think anyone would buy it. Leaping would require me to kill bunnies and a lot of bunnies at that. Um, or from tamed cats, and I'd rather not kill cats because at least the one that I have, I was lucky to even get that. And then what was the other one now? The other one was um, slowness, and that requires leaping. So I'd rather not. So those three... So, so, so those three, I think I would, I would not sell, because just the level of difficulty required to make them, it, it would be too much of a pain in the butt to do. So if we have, um, yeah, but um, that's different. That's a completely different server. The only reason why you'd want harming is for the gambling game. Um... I don't know. I mean, it just seems like unless we built a rabbit farm, which isn't going to happen, I'm not going to get leaping potion anytime soon. And it would be really expensive. If I had one leaping potion, I would sell it for like 10 diamonds because of how much effort it would take to make it. You know what I mean? Yep, there. I lost it. I knew it. I knew I'd lose connection. Sorry about that. I will get back in there in a second. No, it's fine. It's fine. I should have moved around. I should have moved around while I was doing stuff. That's fine. Um, so yeah, so I, so, so space, you're saying you're building a rabbit farm where? On this or seven? On here or seven? Here. Okay. So here's what I'm going to do then. Because I want... I, I really should get this finished. I'm going to leave this as it is right now. I'm not going to sign it. I'm just going to leave it so people can come in. Okay? I'm going to leave this as done. If we get to... Actually, you know what? Hold on. Let's, let's look. Um, new blends all the time. Uh, new blends frequently. Can I can I fit frequently? Nope. Okay. New blends coming soon. Nope. Can't fit that either. Biscuits. Um. Let's see. New brew coming soon. Coming soon. Okay. That's not gonna work either. Jeez. I can't squeeze it. Uh, check out our choices. Um, let me see if I can squeeze a little space. I'm going to have to pretend I'm writing a tweet. Check out our choices. Selection. New brews soon. Okay, Dorito. I like that. We're doing that. We're doing that. Done. Okay. So, we can put that there. And then people can take it. And they can read it. And then, boom. Done. One, two, three, four, five, six. Boom. Done. Okay, so let me put this back to the first page. Done. Plunk it in. There we go. That's it. All she wrote. Repeating for the benefit of stream, I can be your first customer. Well, I have to stock it up a little bit, but help yourself to whatever is here. 
Um, which reminds me, I did I grab anything extra? No, I didn't. So go ahead, see what I got. <laughs> I love this suit! The suit is so cute! I love it. I love it. I'm now curious. I'm watching space. As I go... While, while they're doing that, I'm going to... I'm going to fix... Uh, how did... Fix my moves. Put them back where they were. Let's see. Alright, so the paintings haven't been messed with. And the bookcases haven't been messed with. And the stage hasn't been messed with. Oh, hi, Icy! Welcome to the stream. Can't stay. Wanted to say congrats for 200. Thank you so much. Yeah, we. It. I'm. I'm floored and humbled, um, by all the support, especially tonight and every night. Like you're all great. I. I freaking appreciate you all. If you're looking for something specific space, I probably have it in another, I have it in one of my other shops. I kind of just dumped everything in the barrels. I have to organize it another time. I might do that tomorrow. Just trying to decide, okay. Because I don't have everything up here yet. I have a lot of brewing to do. But I do have regen. You get to be the first person who gets regen. I only made one batch. I actually have to go gas hunting. I really should try to do that now. Since we have keep inventory. Since we have keep inventory, we can do it. I'm going to wait till you make your decision. I want to know what you bought. Did you get what you wanted? I should probably have told people to leave the... Uh, well, they can leave the funds in there. It's fine. Ah, you bought two of the regen potions. Uh, or one of the regen potions. Awesome. First sale at the Nether Mug Cafe. Yes, I am I am putting that somewhere. I might. I have to figure out where to put that. I might make another item frame and put it somewhere. But... Yay, thank you, Space. Um, yay, I'm glad. Well, alright, everybody. Well, this has been quite an adventurous day. We finished the cafe. I mean, look at this. This is amazing. We just have to, I just have to stock it up and, and it'll be good to go. And a lot of that was because of help from you all in space, and it's good stuff. Um, but I just really want to say, real quick, um, thank you so much. Thanks for the raid earlier, Dom. I know you're sleeping, but thank you so very, very much. I appreciate you, um, as always. Uh, we broke 200 followers, which is amazing, and... I'm eternally grateful for all the support and the love and appreciation for the, thanks for the, the the bits and the new subs and everything else. I uh, I am just I'm floored. <laughs> I'm just floored. Um, I am hoping to um, I'm hoping to uh, stream uh, tomorrow, but I don't know what time yet. Um, it all depends on like how much we, we want to do and, and stuff like that. Um, in the meantime, you know, tomorrow's the Hermitcraft stream day. If you're a Hermitcraft fan, you know, make sure you check that out. I'm going to try and get up early so I can watch ZF. Um, but yeah, that's, that's pretty cool. Um, I'm not following Blue Jay, so I might need a link, um, or something. I'll look them up. Uh, but we do need somebody to raid, and I was looking for somebody to raid, and I thought about raiding uh, Mrs. Wells Knight, but we and we raid her quite a bit. 
Um, but Space and M are saying that Blue Jay from um, Blue Jay from the uh, Truly Bedrock. Um, oh, never mind. They ended. Okay. Sk oh, Skiz rated him yesterday. That's right. Okay. Uh, no, he, he rated Liara. He rated Liara. Because um, I was part of that raid. Um, I'm going to go raid Mrs. Wells because I always try to raid Mrs. Wells because I've met her and she's so much fun and she's playing Minecraft and I want to back her up. So we're going to go raid Mrs. Wells. When we get there, say NJ's coffee raid is brewing. Um, and in the meantime, again, thank you so very much. I appreciate all of you. Please do what you can to make sure that you're staying safe through... Oh, and thanks for the last minute follow, um, XIV Flash 23 XV4. I appreciate it. Thank you very, very much. Um, yeah, Mrs. Wells is great. Good night, Mother of Corgis. Good night, Yergi. Good night, M. Good night, Space. Good night, everybody. So let's read Mrs. Wells. NJ's Coffee Raid is brewing. And stay safe. Stay healthy. Wash your hands. Listen to what your officials are, are asking of you to do. And remember to always be excellent to yourselves and to each other. Have a good night. And I'll see you soon. Bye.